Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook, Global Killing. Skills automatically upgrade SSs in seconds. Chapter 1. Tens of billions of people around the world have crossed over and descended into the world of killing. Chen Yu looked at the system prompt in front of him and felt incredible. He didn't expect to encounter such a devil start just after he was reborn. This is a bloody world full of zombies, monsters, and beasts. Only killing is the only rule of survival. If you don't kill decisively, you will be killed by monsters and become something to fill your stomach. After everyone comes to the killing world, they will get an initial skill, the skills from high to low are SSS, SS, S, A, B, C, D, E, F. And not far from Chen Mu, there are three other players who were born in the same place and abandoned unfinished building. This is how the system calls all the people who have traveled through time. However, Unlike ordinary games, once this game is lost, death will be declared. What skills have you awakened? Someone asked. F-level throwing technique can double your throwing power. It feels so weak, how about you? I'm also F-level, and I can increase my movement speed. Does this mean that I should major in escape? With a wry smile. I am E-level, fireball technique, I can summon fireballs to attack, and the release distance is 10 meters. The man who asked the question first said. Grade E, your skill is so cool. That's great. Invincible. Boss, let's form a team. From now on, I will be your most loyal little brother. After learning that the man had awakened E-level skills, the other two immediately started kneeling and licking, recognizing Dage mode. After the man heard this, the corners of his lips rose, he was extremely proud, and felt that he was the son of destiny. Associated Skills Chen Mu was curious about what initial skills he would get. Do you want to extract initial skills? Looking at the system prompt in front of him, Chen Mu no longer hesitated and decided to draw. Drawing in progress. Successful extraction. Congratulations to the host for obtaining F-class air compression. Compressed air. The name seems to be quite powerful, but it's a pity that there is an F-grade in front. Chen Mu tried it out. He compared his right thumb and index finger to a pistol. With a light lift, the air is compressed into the size of a peanut, and it can be shot two meters away. As for the power, it can probably knock down an empty soda can. More than weak, it's just so weak. Devil-style rebirth, the underworld-like start, Chen Mu simply conquered the devil, what is the meaning of rebirth? I don't have a masochistic physique. Name, Chen Mu, age, 22, gender, male, blood type, zero. The identity information is verified correctly, and the one-second SSS level skill upgrade system is being bound. The binding is successful. While Chen Mu was worrying about how to survive in the world of killing with such weak skills, an electronic voice with a strong metallic texture and no emotion suddenly sounded in his mind. System. Chen Mu is no stranger to these two words, it is a perfect life-cheating tool. Has the own plugin finally arrived? Without waiting for Chen Mu to study, what is the function of this system? A system prompt popped up again. It was detected that the host possesses non-SSS level skills, and one key upgrade is in progress. Update success. Congratulations to the host for obtaining SSS level air compression skills. Seeing this prompt, Chen Mu buzzed in his head, the F level skill was upgraded to SSS in seconds, the top level. Apart from Niubi, Chen Mu couldn't find any other adjectives. Hey, boy, do you want to join us and work together to survive in this killing world? At this moment, a questioning voice came from behind the rusty fence that was at least two meters high. No need. Chen Mu resolutely refused. He prefers being a lone wolf rather than cooperating, and he doesn't like being dragged down. Not to mention still in such a world comparable to the end of the world. This makes Zhao Xiaoging who has just been licked and has E-level skills, feel very uncomfortable when he hears this. Shin said that daddy is an E-level skill owner, I will give you a chance to hug your thigh, but you don't want it. I simply don't know the heights of the heavens and the depths of the earth. Zhao Xiaoging didn't want to own the Otherworld Kingdom construction plan, which was blocked at the very beginning. He strode up to Chen Mu, who was only separated by a wall, raised his hand, palm up, and summoned a ball of apple-sized, still dancing fireball, with a high attitude, threateningly said, I am an E-level skill owner, are you sure you want to reject? I advise you to agree. It's better to agree. 
a weak chicken like you can't survive tonight without the cover of Dage, believe it or not. Our Black Tiger Union will surely be famous in history in the future. If you join now, you will be a veteran in the future. We don't think you are weak. Why are you still hesitating? The other two younger brothers also followed immediately, trying to persuade Chen Mu not to be brave. Chen Mu heard their conversation just now, and knew that the taller one was called Li Yuwei, and the fatter one was called Wang Xiaofa. Before switching to the Awakening Duel system, Chen Mu, who only has F-level tasteless skills, may choose to join the group to increase the chance of survival. But now, he is the owner of SSS level skills. Do you think an owner of E-level skills is the boss? If it spreads out, wouldn't it be poked in the spine by someone, and it will be a joke to death? Chen Mu wanted to say something, but saw that Li Yue's complexion changed drastically, he took a half step back, and said in great fear, look quickly. Then, what is that? It's just a dog, what's there to be afraid of? Wang Xiaofa felt that he was making too much of a fuss. You can use the system to check its information. It is called a corpse dog. Its strength, speed, and other attributes are higher than ours. I am afraid that only Boss Zhao's E-level skills can deal with it. Li Yuwei broke out in a cold sweat. Thanks to the steel wire fence, it gave him a sense of security. Boy, give you another chance, surrender to me, I can give you a chance to survive. Just kidding, Zhao Xiaoging is an E-level skill owner, how could he put a mere corpse dog in one's eyes? In the final analysis, isn't that a dog with rotten skin, large ribs and skull exposed, and maggots writhing in the carrion, a slightly disgusting dog? Corpse dog, Chen Mu turned his head to look, not only did not have any fear, but felt that it came just in time, and he could try the SSS level skills he had just acquired. Stinky boy, wait until you die. Seeing Chen Mu directly ignoring him, Zhao Xiaoging was so angry that his chest heaved and he didn't intend to give Chen Mu another chance. Let Li Yue and Wang Xiaofa take a good look at what will happen if you disobey your own people. Use Chen Wei as a pedal to increase the loyalty of your subordinates. Zhao Xiaoging could already foresee the pitiful scene of Chen Mu being thrown down by the corpse dog, torn into pieces, and then asking himself for help. When the time comes, Zhao Xiaoging will definitely reject him without hesitation. Let him know what is the unforgettable despair. Wu, at this moment, the corpse dog was lowering its head, baring its teeth, staring at Chen Mu with murderous intent in its blood-red eyes. Facing the corpse dog that was gradually speeding up and running wildly, Chen Mu raised his arm, likening it to a gun again. Li Yue, is this kid insane? Why do you compare this gesture? Wang Xiaofa, I guess I was scared to death, ha ha ha, you deserve it. I'll give you a chance, you're useless. At this point, the bullet is loaded. After confirming that the corpse dog entered the attack range and launched the ballistic, Chen Mu squeezed the thumb representing the trigger. Boom, boom, the result was astonishing. Corpse dog. It was directly torn into tens of millions of pieces and evaporated in place. In front of Chen Mu was a semicircular destruction depression two or three meters wide that gradually expanded. The widest point is at least 8 or 9 meters. On this road, no matter the stones, trees, or six-story buildings, dot all were destroyed. Broken, so tiny you can't see it. The dust rolls up on both sides, making the ballistic trajectory extremely clear. Quote dot 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 quote. Li Yue. Quote dot 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 quote. Wang Xiaofa. Quote dot 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 quote. Zhao Xiaoging. This destructive power, said to be a battleship-class cannon, the three of them would not doubt it. It's too exaggerated, it's too scary, they were all wondering whether all this had anything to do with Chen Mu. It's okay if there is no, if there is. For some reason, they always feel that there is a knife hanging above their heads, which may fall down at any time and cut themselves in half. Quote dot 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 quote. Not to mention the trio, even Chen Mu himself never expected this result because he only used 20 to 30 percent of his strength, and 70 percent to 80 percent of his strength was useless. Chen Mu couldn't imagine what an astonishing effect it would be if he used all his strength, piercing through the entire city with one blow. A mountain, as expected of an SSS level skill, successfully killed the corpse dog. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Kill point. After inquiring about the system, 
Chen Niu learned that killing points can be used to upgrade skills, or to buy goods in the mall, such as weapons and ammunition, or food resources. Boss, corpse dogs. There are also corpse dogs inside. Hearing Li Yue's terrified voice, Chen Niu turned his head to look, and found that the trio was already being targeted by two other corpse dogs. All of them bared their teeth, their faces were ferocious, and even the corpse dog's lips were rotten in a large area, unable to cover a sharp tooth, and the whole tooth was exposed to the air, full of deterrence. If this is bitten, it must be deep enough to see the bones. Why panic? I have a fireball. Zhao Xiaoging shook off Li Yue and grabbed On's hands tightly, palms up, summoned a fireball, then raised his hand high, and threw it at the corpse dog. As a result, what Zhao Xiaoging didn't expect was that the corpse dog was too nimble and couldn't hit it at all. Even if he used all his hands, he still couldn't even scratch the fur of the corpse dog. What kind of shit is this, why is it so fast? Can't the E-level skills even deal with this kind of mob? You're still playing. Zhao Xiaoging was about to collapse. At the same time, without saying a word, Wang Xiaofa used his movement skills to quickly move to the gate while everyone's attention was on the corpse dog, untied the chain, and ran out. Hearing the sound of the iron chain falling, Zhao Xiaoging blushed with anger, are you dumb? I don't know what to say. It's too shameful to be a deserter. Li Yue scolded. The two quickly ran towards the gate, and the corpse dog chased after them. Seeing that Zhao Xiaoging was about to be overtaken, he summoned a fireball and threw it on Li Yue. Ah, Li Yue screamed, and the legs of his trousers burned quickly, and the more he patted, the more intense the fire became. Boom, wow. Then he was thrown to the ground by two corpse dogs at the same time, one tearing Li Yue's arm, while the other bit tightly, tearing his unburned leg. Ah, let go, let me go, beast, get out. Li Yue was terrified and struggled, but he was no match for the two corpse dogs. Stab it. The pants were ripped apart, and at the same time, there was flesh. Flesh torn. Bleeding. Help me. Save me. Li Yue felt powerless under the double damage of the corpse dog and the flames. He looked at the panicked Zhao Xiaoging and stretched out his hand to grab him. The vision is blurred, looking close, but actually getting farther and farther away. Ha, ha. Dot ha, ha. Zhao Xiaoging panted heavily, sweating uncontrollably, and quickly ran out of the gate, slamming it shut with his body. Whoever thought that the hinge was so rusted that it couldn't bear Zhao Xiaoging's weight at all. Boom, ah, the whole person, together with an iron door, fell straight down, making a loud noise. The noise immediately attracted the attention of the corpse dog, and Li Yue, who was bitten half to death, covered in blood and injured, ran towards him with four powerful dog legs. Ah, seeing the situation, Zhao Xiaoging quickly got up, not caring about the pain, and ran towards Chen Mu. He intends to repeat the old trick, using his status as the boss, to order Wang Xiaofa, hurry up. Use him as a bait to attract the attention of those two corpse dogs, otherwise we won't be able to escape, we will all die here. Quote. Quote dot 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 quote. Wang Xiaofa hesitated for half a second, and finally nodded in agreement, okay. Why hesitate? Just because Zhao Xiaoging's E-level skills are not as invincible as he imagined. Not even a few dogs can handle it. But it's not useless. From the beginning to the end, Wang Xiaofa never connected the horrific trace of destruction with Chen Mu. It's normal to think that something unreasonable will happen to kill the world. If that was really what Chen Mu did, why would he be scared? Wang Xiaofa persuaded himself to sacrifice Chen Mu to win the chance of survival for himself and Zhao Xiaoging. He bent down and picked up a stone that was not too big or small on the ground, which could be grasped with a fist, and prepared to take advantage of his speed to quickly go around behind Chen Mu and knock him out. Very good. Seeing Wang Xiaofa circled behind Chen Mu, aiming at his head with his raised arm, about to smash it down, Zhao Xiaoging smiled ferociously, and at the same time breathed a long sigh of relief. I have a chance to survive. In the next second, Zhao Xiaoging stopped suddenly. Scared. Quote dot 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 quote. Wang Xiaofa also looked dazed, suddenly he couldn't feel the existence of his arm, turned his head to look, only to find that the incision on his shoulder was extremely complete. The whole arm fell to the foot at some point. I just feel creepy, and the fear is so thick that it is suffocating. Ah, it's just that there was no chance to scream out, and there was a tightness in the neck. 
It's getting tighter. It's getting tighter. When Wang Xiaofa stretched out his hands to grab it, he couldn't catch anything. The feeling of suffocation became more and more intense, and his eyes were bloodshot. He became anxious, and began to ignore the pain, and it didn't matter if he picked off the flesh. He just wanted to breathe fresh air as soon as possible. Kuchi. The next second, the sound of landing. Rolling to Chen Emu's feet, her eyes widened and her face was full of horror. Chen Mu can not only compress air into shells, but also compress air into an invisible and intangible string. Or a sharp knife. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for getting a 1% speed bonus and automatically upgrading to SSS level infinite teleportation. Another SSS level skill. This was something Chen Mu never expected. Second, what I didn't expect was that killing the player would drop skills, no wonder it was called killing the world. You, what did you do? Zhao Xiaoging asked with a silly expression. Chen Mu is the only person nearby, and another one is lying on the ground, half dead. Once was okay, twice. Zhao Xiaoging really couldn't lie to himself anymore, all of this has nothing to do with Chen Mu. At this time, the two corpse dogs had already narrowed the distance between them and Zhao Xiaoging, exerting strength on all fours, they easily flew up to a height of one or two meters. Out of the corner of Zhao Xiaoging's eye, he could see the vague mouth of apes. Kuchi, Kuchi, slap. At this time, there was a sound of exploding pulp in my ears, and then thick, temperatureless liquid splashed on my face. Quote dot 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 quote. So frightened that Zhao Xiaoging forgot to breathe for a moment. Looking down, the heads of the two corpse dogs were pierced and suspended in the air. Wrong. If you look closely, you will find that the blood makes the invisible blade reveal part of its outline and sharpness. What skill is this? S. Or SS. Recalling the previous disastrous shot, Zhao Xiaoging immediately thought, SSS. This guy actually awakened the SSS skill. Zhao Xiaoging clenched his teeth, expressing indescribable envy and hatred. He knew better than anyone else that Chen Mu would never let him go, because when he killed Wang Xiaofa, he was so decisive, without any hesitation. Zhao Xiaoging didn't want to die aggrieved with anger in his chest, so he said, Don't think you are so good, you are just lucky and have awakened SSS level skills, if both sides have no skills, you will never win I. Then, Zhao Xiaoging's pupils shrank suddenly, and his eyes widened like copper bells. He could clearly see Chen Mu teleporting in front of him from more than 10 meters away. A sneer curled up on Chen Mu's lips, that's right, I'm just lucky, don't you know that luck is also a part of strength? Not only have I awakened one SSS skill, I have two more, and soon, there will be a third. What? Two SSS level skills? Zhao Xiaoging's pupils trembled, he hesitated to speak. He raised his hands and covered his neck but he couldn't cover the blood that squeezed out from between his fingers. Ah, ah, his eyes rolled white, and he died in despair. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the E-level fireball technique, which will automatically upgrade to SSS level world extinguishing sky fire. Have an SSS level skill at hand. This feeling really makes people get goosebumps and is extremely excited. Chen Mu began to look forward to the future of life successfully killed the corpse dog congratulations to the host for getting one kill point successfully killed the corpse dog congratulations to the host for getting one kill point plus two kill points help me at this moment li yue's faint cry for help came from his ear chen Mu came to his side in an instant li yue could vaguely see a person entering his field of vision savior no it was king yama who came to take his life Anyway, this guy can't survive, either he will be infected as a zombie, or he will die. It's better to turn it into own experience value and add an SSS level skill for yourself. Chen Mu raised his arm, spread his five fingers, and between his clenched hands, there was an invisible knife. Hanging in Li Yue's heart. Kuchi, push down hard and penetrate. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level throwing technique which is automatically upgraded to SSS level 10,000 times stronger. In less than half a day, he possessed four SSS level skills. How can Chen Emu's mood at this moment be described by a single word? As for why he can be so decisive, cruel, bloody. The reason is simple, 
because before he was reborn, he was a mercenary who had been rampant on the battlefield for 15 years, a profession that was used to life and death, and the hail of bullets, with a very high death rate. Opening the virtual panel of the system, Chen Mu wants to see what can be purchased at the killing point and what the value is. The World Trade Center has been unlocked. The World Chat Channel has been unlocked. After opening the virtual panel, two system prompts popped up one after another. World Trading Center, World Chat Channel, the literal meaning is not difficult to understand. Chen Mu entered the World Trading Center first. The number of posts is not too much. In terms of tens of billions of people, most of them are posts for exchanging food resources. Afterwards, Chen Mu opened the World Chat Channel again. It is divided into random channels in the world. After entering, they will be randomly assigned to a room. The people in this room are also random and different every time they enter. There is also a regional chat channel, where the chatters are all the players closest to you. This is close, but there is no way to know how far it is, and the system did not say it clearly. Chen Mu chose to enter the regional chat channel, wanting to see how many competitors are eyeing around him. Or experience baby, anyone want to form a team? What I am awakening is F-level sword swing. The more times you swing the sword, the greater the power. However, the maximum amount of swings is only 10 times, and it will be reset after reaching it. My location is at bus stop number 10. If you want to form a team, you can contact. I am a cute girl, surrounded by zombies, is there any little big brother who is willing to come to the garden area to save me, if you are willing to come, I can promise you anything. I just heard in a certain world chat channel that not only killing monsters can get killing point rewards, killing players also has a chance to get the opponent's skill drop, people are unpredictable, you better be careful. It's fine to kill monsters, why do you still want us to kill each other? This world is too cruel. Nonsense, otherwise, what is it called killing the world? D level skill frost art, I plan to create a guild. If you are interested, you can come to me. Don't worry. I want to create a strong team instead of gambling on the chance of dropping skills. Only cooperation can be better. Live. D level skills. What kind of big boss is this? Begging for the address. I want to join. Make a pendant for the boss. Dot dot dot. Seeing a person with D level skills being crazily touted by others, hugging his thighs, it can be seen how rare advanced skills are, and F level skills are the vast majority. A D level is so respected. So his 4 SSS level skills. Shaking his head, he stopped thinking about it. Chen Mu left the world chat channel, there was not much valuable information in it, and opened them all. Sand Eagle Pistol, 1 killing point. Universal bullets for pistols, 100 rounds, 1 killing point. Canned beef, 10 pieces per box, 1 killing point. Mineral water, 1 box of 12 bottles, killing point. Dot dot dot. Looking at it. The products are much richer than Chen Mu imagined, ranging from pistols, rockets, snipers, and even Gatling, everything. Down to food, water, combat suits, there are many categories. One Gatling only needs 10 kill points, which shows how cost-effective the kill points are. But thinking about it carefully, it seems that it is not so easy to face zombie dogs with E-level skills and 2F-level skills just now. Maybe it's because they just traveled here, and their combat proficiency is not high yet. After thinking about it, Chen Mu spent two killing points to buy food and water resources from the mall. Purchased successfully, kill point minus one, congratulations to the host for getting mineral water x1 box. Purchased successfully, kill point minus one, congratulations to the host for getting one box of canned beef. The killing system comes with a backpack grid, a total of 10, you can store items in it, and you don't have to hold it in your hand all the time, which will only delay your action. It can be said that it is quite thoughtful. Snapped. Chen Mu was hungrier than expected. He took out a can of beef, picked up the tab, and opened the iron cover. Without caring about being particular, he scooped up a large piece of beef with his hands, put it into his mouth, and started to eat it. One word, fragrant. A box of canned beef was quickly wiped out by Chen Mu, not even a drop of oil or water was spared. Boom, flame was born out of thin air in the palm of the hand, and the oil was evaporated at high temperature so that it was no longer sticky. Gouda Gouda, he took out another bottle of water, raised his head, 
drank most of the bottle in one go, and put the rest back into the system backpack, there is no need to waste it. Quote dot 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 quote. Wow. At this time, Chen Yu suddenly heard a familiar low growl from behind. The quantity is quite huge. Turning around and looking, these dozens of dead dogs came from nowhere. There are horse dogs, golden retrievers, as big as Alaska, as small as Pomeranian. I have to say, there are quite a lot of species. Chen Yu ignored the killing point delivered to her door. This is his important source of food. Buying it directly is obviously more reliable than searching in the ruins. Not to mention the low probability of finding it. After finding it, who knows if it has expired. In case of bad stomach, go to the hospital. Looking for zombie nurses and doctors to treat yourself. Uh, bye, forever. Directly invulnerable to all poisons. Chen Nuping raised his arms, like a big rock spreading its wings, his fingers spread out, slightly bent inwards, and at the same time, it was visible that the flesh on his fingers was strangled with red marks. Wow, wow. On the other side, the team of corpse dogs had assembled, as if they had received an order, they rushed towards Chen Mu. 30 meters, 15 meters, 10 meters. After confirming that all the corpse dogs had entered the attack range, Chen Mu swung his arms inward and crossed. Stained in blood, the long air knives connected to Chen Mu's fingers appeared in outline. The blood of the corpse dog was splashed in the air like splashed ink, splashing more than 10 meters away. As for the dozens of dead dogs, they were all cut into meat pieces of different sizes, with even incisions, and thick, blackened blood flowed out slowly. The internal organs that rolled outside had long been eaten away by white maggots, and when they landed, they burst open. There were at least a hundred of them, their fat bodies frantically swinging in the blood plasma and carrion, obviously frightened. Successfully killed the corpse dog. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Successfully killed the corpse dog. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Successfully killed the corpse dog. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Dot dot dot. Killing at 18 o'clock is easy. Chen Mu flicked his fingers lightly, and the air blade disappeared. This SSS level skill is comfortable to use. The power of Chen Mu's second system is not only that any skill can be upgraded to SSS in seconds, but at the same time of upgrading to SSS, the proficiency is also directly full to 100%. The word invincible is at your fingertips. And this scene was witnessed by a person who had just woken up in the building. He was still rejoicing just now that he had awakened the E-level skill, which might be able to sweep away the decadence of his previous life and achieve something in this world called killing. Then I saw the shocking scene of Chen Mu waving his hands and beheading dozens of corpse dogs out of thin air in an instant. She was so frightened that she trembled all over, dared not breathe, and broke out in a cold sweat. Quote dot 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 quote. He covered it tightly with his hands and pinched his mouth, for fear of making a sound, if Chen Mu's attention was caught, he would kill him along with himself. Zhao Xiaoging, Li Yuwei, and Wang Xiaofa's corpses, he was not blind, he could see them. That point of pride was crushed by Chen Mu's formidable strength. Since all players are already familiar with the killing world, the daily task will be released in three minutes, please prepare well, players. Daily Tasks In Chen Mu's understanding, the word task is usually accompanied by rewards. I don't know what reward there will be. Chen Mu was curious. Three minutes passed in a blink of an eye. The daily task has been released. Please go to the designated place, complete the number of kills, and you can get rewards. Designated place. Chen Mu turned off the system panel, and then saw a red prompt in front of him, 1654 meters. The killing task he received was to kill five upgraded spiders. As for the rewards he would get, the system didn't say clearly, and he would only know after completing them. There is no need to travel hard, within the range of the naked eye, Chen Yu can teleport directly to realize space jump. There are two ways to use infinite teleportation. One is within the visible range. One is where you have been. Chen Yu saw hundreds of meters at a glance, aiming at a tall building with more than 30 floors. The whole person disappeared instantly. Disappeared. The man hiding behind the wall was startled again. At this time, Chen Mu was already at the top of the 30-story building, overlooking the city. Turning around, looking at the abandoned unfinished building, even though this is his own skill, he still can't help but marvel, 
it's a few hundred meters away, and it can be reached in less than a blink of an eye, awesome. It's amazing. Without thinking too much, he turned around again and continued to lock on that icon. Because standing high enough, you can directly see where the marking points are. Teleport, arrive in seconds, standing in front of the mall, the place is quieter than expected, like a cemetery. But the quieter it is, the more unsettled it is. The task is random, and Chen Mu is not sure if there is anyone like him who has been assigned to this mall to complete the task. As the saying goes, people know that ghosts are scary, and ghosts know that people are poisonous. Chen Mu worked hard to avoid someone like Zhao Xiaoging appearing again. It's fine if the well water doesn't offend the river water, but if someone offends him, he will be punished no matter how far away. Pull back the plastic, dusty, weathered door curtain. Ahem. Chen Mu raised his hand to fan the breeze in front of him, blowing away the dust that was floating in front of his eyes and wanted to get into his body. After entering the mall, you can find that there is a huge boulder in the center and many large pieces of gravel. Looking up, it turned out that the ceiling had fallen. If you look closely, you can find that at the edge, there is a white bone arm with decayed flesh and blood. It is estimated that the ceiling was shattered, and when it fell, the victims had no time to react and fled. The elevator had been out of service for a long time, so Chen Mu took the stairs to the second floor. He was very sure that the place indicated by the system was here, but why didn't half of the upgraded spiders see it? There are quite a lot of spider webs, but they are all covered with thick dust and have lost their stickiness. Could it be that the system made a mistake? Stop. Don't move. A Taoist voice came from behind. Seeing that Chen Mu refused to listen and wanted to turn around, the man directly pulled the trigger. Boom. A gunshot made Chen Mu's ears tingle. However, the gunshot did not stop Chen Mu from turning around and looking away. Is that a person? Chen Mu is not sure because his face was being hugged by a spider. Eight spider legs pierced into the flesh and were locked with hooks. The man seemed to have taken tough measures, and he could see the wounds where the flesh was torn and opened. The spider was a little smaller than the man's head, and it just hugged the whole face. One eye was exposed from the gap between the spider's legs. You, come here for me, find a way to get rid of this thing for me, or I will kill you. No matter how tough the tone is, it is not difficult to hear that it is more fear and panic. Chen Mu is sure that the man must not be so weak before this. It should be said that normal people would never be skinny like this. Obviously, that face-hugging spider is crazily absorbing his nutrients. Until he was completely squeezed into a mummy. If Chen Mu remembers correctly, someone said before that the system can check the information of monsters. He fixed his eyes on the face-hugging spider, checked it for confirmation, and the system panel popped up immediately. Name. Face-hugging upgraded spider. Introduction. An upgraded spider that is good at ambush and will find the right time to launch a sneak attack. Once it succeeds, it will be unable to break free and will be slowly drained of blood until death. Note. Every time a person's blood is successfully absorbed, the spider's level will increase accordingly, and its size, speed, and various attribute abilities will increase. Stinky boy, am I talking to you? You are deaf, and you still can't understand human speech. Do as I say, otherwise, don't blame me for shooting you. Staring at himself at every turn, the man became annoyed and shouted loudly. He raised his arm and aimed the muzzle of the black hole at Chen Emu's head, with his index finger close to the trigger, ready to pull it again at any moment, sending him to meet King Yama with a single bullet. For a mortal man, Chen Mu didn't want to waste his saliva. Instead of letting a man provide nourishment to the upgraded spider and be drained to death, it is better to do it yourself, send him away from the world, and get another skill by the way. The man didn't notice at all that Chen Mu's right hand had already moved. The thumb pressed the middle finger, and two seconds later, the middle finger popped out. Boom. The man only felt a gust of wind sweeping across his face, very strong, like a pair of invisible big hands, slapping his cheeks nonstop. Quote dot 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 quote. Dazed, he slowly lowered his head, looking at the big hole in his chest, the man opened his mouth. Can't hide the shock. Ah, before he could say a single word, he was killed on the spot. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining F-level pistol proficiency and automatically upgrading to SSS-level firearms all around.
Judging from the records Chen Mu saw in the World Chat channel, it is indeed possible for a player to get a skill drop by killing the player, but the probability is very small. However, I seem to enjoy a 100% skill drop rate because of the second system. Why do I always feel that this system is trying to train me to be an out and out murderer? Chen Mu laughed at himself. But right now, he obviously doesn't have that much time to think about these things. The face hugging spider seemed not interested in dead bodies, so it pulled out eight spider legs with a strong steel texture that penetrated deep into the man's face. Turning around, quickly moving the eight spider legs, the black shadow rushed towards Chen Mu for a moment. So fast, Chen Mu quickly raised his hand, with five fingers open and clenched, an invisible sword appeared, aimed at the face hugging spider, and stabbed straight down. Kuchi, the blade pierced through the face hugging spider's head, and then broke through the tiles, penetrating several centimeters into the ground. The face hugging spider let out a unique scream, struggled a few times, and then lost its response. Successfully killed the face hugging spider. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Is it the same level as a corpse dog? Chen Mu murmured. Stepping over the face hugging spider's body, Chen Mu walked towards the man's body bent down, opened his fingers, picked up the pistol he was still holding tightly in his hand, and found a few bullets from him. Including those in the magazine, there are nine rounds in total. It's not very useful for Chen Mu, so there's no skill to use. There is no harm in keeping it, it can be exchanged for resources at the World Trade Center. Put it in the system backpack. Right now, the task of killing one of the five upgraded spiders has been completed, and there are four remaining. But Chen Mu wandered around, but he didn't see the shadow of the upgraded spider. Could it be that my attack was too cruel just now and scared them? Don't dare to come out. Searching for it like this is a waste of time and energy. Chen Mu also wanted to find a suitable place to rest before dark. Wandering in this world full of zombies and monsters at night, Chen Mu still felt that it was too risky. Looking out of the window, the sky is already glowing orange-red, and the sun is estimated to set in half an hour. Thinking of this, Chen Mu decided not to waste any more time, and decided to change his mind, walked to the tempered glass window, locked his eyes on a tall building, and teleported there. At the same time, at the intersection one or two hundred meters away from the shopping mall. A man and a woman are watching their surroundings, walking in the middle of the road, approaching the mall. Obviously, they also received the same task as Chen Mu, and they needed to go to the mall to complete it. Zimming, I'm afraid, what if another monster suddenly appears and wants to eat us? Don't worry, your crisis sensing skills, together with my archer skills, will surely kill them before they eat us. The man named Han Zimming comforted the woman. Chen Mu noticed the existence of the two of them, and was a little surprised. He didn't expect to see couples in this kind of place. Show affection die fast, silently complained, and immediately raised his right arm, deciding to try the SSS level skill that he had never had a chance to use, extinguishing world and heaven fire. Based on Chen Emu's understanding of this skill, it is more than enough to destroy most of the city, but it takes a long time to prepare. Chen Mu only intends to destroy them all. Since those little spiders don't want to come out, let's take their old nest directly. In midair, directly above the shopping mall, the fireball began to expand continuously, like magma flowing, surrounded by flames, ranging from the size of a head to 5 meters. 10 meters, 20 meters in diameter, 30 meters in diameter, even 100 meters. The light is dazzling and the temperature is hot. Quote dot 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 quote. Han Ziming and the woman were stunned in place, looking up at the big ball of fire. For a moment, they almost thought they were hallucinating that the sun was about to fall. The hot sweat kept overflowing, and it was impossible to wipe it off. The white short sleeves became translucent, revealing the light blue color of the bra underneath. Zimming, then, what is that? The woman grabbed Han Zimming's arm tightly and asked in fear. I think someone is using skills, right? Han Zimming was also a little uncertain. Skill, what kind of skill can summon such a big fireball? Isn't that too exaggerated? The woman couldn't understand. If it's really a skill, it should be at least S rank, or higher. Han Ziming was more envious than surprised. S rank, if we can join forces with him, it should be a very easy thing to survive. The woman thought suddenly. Don't be kidding, 
how could such a big man think highly of rubbish like us? To him, we are just a burden. Han Ziming shook his head, laughed at himself, and told women not to think about what they have. He decided to wait for Chen Mu to unleash his skills before completing the shopping mall mission. But then again, did you see any monsters in the sky? What is he trying to attack? Rumble. Just as Han Ziming was wondering, the fireball crashed down, and the wind and waves that were raised were like the rising tide of the sea, crazily rushing in, extremely hot, as if the two of them were placed in a microwave oven, roasting at 360 degrees without dead ends. The whole person is dehydrated quickly, and the mouth is dry. Even if you swallow a little, you will feel like your throat is cut by a knife. The picture in front of him even became distorted due to the high temperature. Then, I witnessed that the large-scale shopping mall was crushed under the fireball. Raised to the ground. The sky was full of dust and visibility plummeted. Immediately, a system prompt popped up in front of my eyes. Because the mission site disappeared, the mission was cancelled and the mission failed. Quote dot 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 quote. Han Ziming. Woman. The woman came to her senses first, and tugged at Han Ziming's sleeve, I saw that the mission location disappeared, the mission was cancelled, and it automatically failed. Me too. Han Ziming never expected that the task would be over before it even started. Do all the bosses complete tasks like this? Take the own road and let others have nowhere to go. The key point is not to dare to complain, in case people hear it, a fireball hangs above the head, and a few lives will not be enough to die by then. The killing mission has been completed, congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level mission package. As for Chen Mu, it was completely different from the system prompt that Han Ziming and the others saw. The task is successfully completed and the reward is in hand. Successfully killed the face-hugging spider. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Successfully killed the face-hugging spider. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Successfully killed the brain-eater zombie. Congratulations to the host for getting two kill points. Dot dot dot. This sky fire came, and at the same time brought more than 50 killing points to Chen Mu. It was a great harvest. Now that the mission is complete, it's time to find a place to live. Ha! Huh. At this moment, Chen Mu keenly noticed that there was a huge black shadow running fast in the smoke and dust. Round body, pointed long legs. In the next second, the big guy broke through the smoke and was exposed. It was a giant upgraded spider. The appearance doesn't need much change. A creature like a spider is magnified hundreds of times and the details become clear. It's scary in itself. There were many cracks in the hard shell of the brown earth texture, and even a large piece fell off, revealing the tender flesh and blood. On the back, on the spider legs, everywhere. Did you actually hold that fireball? Chen Mu thought it shouldn't be. No matter how hard the shell of this spider is, it can be harder than concrete walls and steel bars. There is a high probability that they sensed the danger and fled first, but they were still seriously injured by the remaining power of the fireball. The giant upgraded spider was running towards Han Ziming's couple. All this cannot be said to have nothing to do with him, but Chen Mu has no intention of helping the two of them. What's more, at this distance, even if he has the SSS level teleportation skill, there is no time for him to make a move. Looking in front of him, a spider the size of a giant elephant raised its forelimbs sharper than a spear. Han Ziming didn't even have a chance to react. Poochie. The chest was already pierced by the spear spider leg. Lowering his head, looking at the picture of his chest being stained red, it was only at this moment that Han Ziming recalled that he should do something. The longbow was transformed, the arrow was strung, no matter whether it was aimed or not, it was pulled to the limit, and shot out. I don't know whether to call him lucky or unlucky. Fortunately, the arrow hit the spider's unprotected flesh and blood even though it was not aimed at it. Most of the arrow body is missing. The pain caused the spider to split up and down, enough to swallow Han Ziming's whole body easily. The saliva was drawn into a thread, dense and intricate, and because of the roar and breath coming out of the throat, it poured on Han Ziming's body. The saliva was extremely viscous and surprisingly thick, completely enveloping Han Ziming in it. It's like wrapping it with plastic wrap, three layers inside and three layers outside. The feeling of suffocation is getting stronger. Han Ziming desperately pawed and pulled with his hands, using his face and tongue to push it up, but it was useless at all. 
he pulled it away a little, and the saliva that slowly flowed down quickly filled those fingerprints. In this way, Han Ziming's movements changed from fierce to slow. Not long after, his hands dropped and he leaned back, completely losing his response. Poochie. At this time, the spider lifted up another spider leg and penetrated Han Ziming's body. The two spider legs matched each other like a human hand, lifted up the corpse, and bit off most of it with one bite. Wow! The blood exploded, spattered the limp legs, and slumped on the woman sitting on the ground. Apart from fear, there is only one thing on the woman's mind, to run away. However, the limbs of the body seemed to be non-existent, completely uncontrollable, and he could only watch helplessly as the giant spider easily chewed up his boyfriend's body and swallowed it. Don't, don't, don't eat me. The woman shook her head slightly, whispering softly. Immediately, there was a sudden explosion, help me. Please, save me, I am willing to do anything for you. I am willing to be your slave. Serve you for the rest of my life, please, save me. These words were naturally addressed to Chen Mu. She knew the owner of the fireball was still nearby. There is only one hope left. Women think they are pretty, and maybe they can use this to impress Chen Mu. However, there was no response at all. At the same time, the giant spider had already eaten Han Ziming's whole body, and dropped half of a shoe, which landed in front of the woman. Quote dot 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 quote. Opening her mouth wide, the woman was too frightened to speak as she watched the giant spider approaching her step by step. Poochie. Quote dot 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 quote. Then, the chest seemed familiar, and was pierced by a giant spider with its spider legs. Chen Mu appeared, in time. This timeliness is not for a woman, she is completely enveloped by the word despair at this moment. Also because of excessive blood loss, consciousness became more and more blurred. Chen Mu raised his hand, compared his thumb and index finger to a pistol, and pulled the trigger. Silently, before the giant spider, send the woman away from this killing world that is not suitable for her. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the E-level danger perception ability and automatically upgrading to the SSS level danger perception ability. After realizing Chen Emu's existence, the giant spider quickly raised the spider leg spear high, preparing to use the same method to penetrate Chen Mu. But before that, its eight spider legs were all tied up by Chen Mu with strings. Falling into the air, even if it is only a short distance away, even with all the strength of the whole body, there is no way to go down any further. Chen Mu waved his hand, pulling the threads. Kuchi, Kuchi, puff. The huge force instantly tore off all eight legs of the giant spider, revealing fresh and pink strands of meat. Blood rush. After losing the spider legs and losing the ability to move, how to deal with it is a matter of Chen Mu's words. Raise your hand and summon a fireball the size of a watermelon. Aim at the abyssal giant mouth of the giant spider that is stretched to the limit and covered with terrifying fangs, and throw it in with all your strength. Boom! Suddenly, the giant spider froze. In the next second, the fireball expanded in its belly and exploded it. Successfully killed the giant spider. Congratulations to the host for getting three kill points. It was not as bloody as imagined, because most of the flesh and blood turned into coke. Turning around and looking down, the woman's chest was broken with a big hole, the buttons and bodice were broken, and spread to both sides. It was supposed to be a beautiful scene, but now it is only hideous. Bloody. Chen Mu can even see a cross-section of the heart. Only the outline of the chest remained, and the rest turned into rotten meat. Withdrawing his gaze, Chen Mu disappeared out of thin air. Hey, it's a pity. I wasted a chance to get an SSS level skill in the account. It seems that the next time I make a move, I have to be decisive and let the giant spider take advantage of it for nothing. Three kill points is not bad, but Chen Mu is an adult, and all of them are the basic operation. I have moved at least a thousand meters. Why can't I find a suitable place to sleep? It's broken and dusty everywhere. How can I sleep peacefully? Chen Mu said in a helpless tone. Dirty and messy, you can barely bear it. This dilapidated, Flimsy wall is full of cracks and even big holes. Chen Mu is very worried that when he is asleep, zombie monsters will sneak in and snatch away the little one. Life. He was a pretty dead sleeper. Fortunately, I got the SSS level danger perception skill from the woman, which allows me to sense in advance and predict all attacks. Combined with infinite teleportation, 
Chen Emu's chances of surviving have increased dozens of times. Seeing that there is only a little bit of light in the sky, the darkness almost completely submerges the range that can be seen at a glance. Standing on top of a tall building, Chen Mu looked around and finally identified a glass building with a rough estimate of a hundred floors. Right above the roof of the building, there are three large red characters with paint peeling off. Wei Hotel, originally there were four, but the character behind Wei has collapsed, leaving only a few support columns of different lengths. However, the most eye-catching thing is probably the location on the 30th or 40th floor. The huge hole with a diameter of more than 10 meters made people wonder what it was that was destroyed. Monster, how huge and terrifying is the monster that can cause such destructive marks? Chen Mu teleported to the hole and turned around to look. Fortunately, he did not have a fear of heights, otherwise this scene was quite terrifying. His feet were only a few centimeters away from the air. Turning around to face the building, with the last bit of sunlight, Chen Mu could vaguely see the real culprit who created the big hole. A fighter jet burned down to its skeleton. At this time, the sun went down completely, and the night completely enveloped the sky and the earth. I can't see my fingers. It seems that it is very necessary to get another night vision ability. Hiss. Chen Mu suddenly recalled that he had seen a night vision device in the system store before, and only needed one kill point. It feels very bulky, wearing it really affects the movement, and it's still a green visual screen. Dot dot dot, purchased successfully, killing point minus one, congratulations to the host for getting a strong flashlight. The high light flashlight and the night vision device are priced at the same price. Although Chen Mu feels that there is a huge difference in technology between the two, the lowest price in the system store seems to be one kill point, and there is no such thing as a fraction of a kill point. The only consolation is that this powerful flashlight has unlimited power and can be used all the time. Press the switch, and a beam of light illuminates the surroundings. The farther away, the more blurred, and there will be subtle sounds from time to time. Chen Mu chose to go straight, came to the fighter plane, climbed up the hill formed by the debris of the wall, and shone the flashlight into the driving position. It was a blackened skeleton, still wearing a seat belt, and only a broken metal shell remained on the helmet. In the next second, Chen Mu noticed movement in his eye sockets. Before he could move, densely packed little spiders crawled out of the two eye sockets like a tide, rushing towards the surroundings. Fortunately, these little guys have no desire to attack him, and they belong to the behavior of fleeing after feeling the danger. Chen Mu has lost interest in researching this plane, and the immediate priority is to find a suitable room, have a good night's rest, replenish his strength, and act again at dawn. Before having cat-like eyes that can pierce the night, even with SSS level skills, Chen Mu doesn't intend to take risks, there is no need for that. At this time, Chen Mu's hair stood on end, and a scene quickly flashed through his mind. In the next second, a strange noise came from the skeleton that was lying quietly. To be precise, there is Dong XZ in it. With his eyes wide open, Chen Mu quickly turned sideways to avoid it. A long strip of living matter, like a spring, is ejected from the skeleton's suddenly open mouth. Almost close to Chen Mu's face, he flew over. Landed two meters away. Chen Mu reacted quickly and took a flashlight to see it, and found that it was a long insect, at least two meters long, pieced together one by one, different in length, flat, with a sucker mouth. After sensing the coming flashlight from Chen Mu, the mouthparts were rounded, revealing the spiral shape extending inward, like endless fangs. There are hundreds of them that only Chen Mu can see. Saliva splash. It seems to be intimidating Chen Mu. Chen Mu always felt that this thing was a bit like the tapeworm, a human parasite, that he saw in biology books when he was a child. Wait. Chen Mu turned his head to look at the skeleton in the cockpit. Could it be that this guy was parasitized by it, and that's why he lost control and crashed into the building? Dog, you still want to parasitize me? Chen Mu summoned a flame. The fire is dazzling, quote dot 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 quote. I suddenly realize that I obviously have such a useful lighting skill, why would I spend a killing point to buy a flashlight? On the other hand, the parasite seemed to be very afraid of fire. After seeing the fire, it immediately closed its mouth and planned to escape. Its behavior was similar to that of a snake. How could Chen Mu give it a chance, predicted its position, and hit it directly with a fireball? Boom. 
The fireball touched the ground, exploded, and the flames burned within three or four meters. From this point of view, it seems that there is no need to predict at all. Chen Mu laughed at himself. The range of damage is much higher than he imagined. The parasite was engulfed by the sea of flames, making a shrill roar, constantly turning its body, and a large number of small hook-shaped spikes emerged from the surface of the body, presumably used to fix the internal organs and prevent them from being excreted by the parasite. Cunning guy. Chen Mu showed no sympathy. Successfully killed the upgraded parasitic tapeworm. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Brother, I avenge you. Chen Mu glanced sideways at the skeleton. For a person, learning to self-regulate his mood is, in his opinion, a very important part. Withdraw the flames, reunite into a fireball in the palm of your hand, pinch your five fingers together, extinguish it, dissipate, and thick smoke shoots out from between your fingers. The orange flame was too weird, Chen Mu was more used to the strong white light of the flashlight. After all, killing points are all spent, and the goods cannot be returned. After that, I don't know how long it will be in the bottom of the box. It's worth the money if you can use it more while you still think about it. Well, again, it is very important for a person to learn to self-regulate his mood, and it is an essential psychological skill. Open the door, come to the corridor, look around, it is quiet. It was clean and free of any clutter other than dust. The plants in the pots are already dead. Boom. Chen Mu went straight to the door directly opposite. He didn't need a room card, and directly fired an air bullet, which penetrated and completely destroyed the structure of the lock cylinder. Because the eyes can't penetrate the door, the teleportation skills are useless. It's much cleaner in here than expected. Move the shoe cabinet and block the door. Chen Mu came to the bed, took off the quilt, and threw it aside. There was a lot of dust on it, and he didn't bother to clean it up. The weather is not cold at the moment, so there is no need for such things. Lying on the bed, this soft feeling immediately makes people relax, let out a long sigh of relief, ha. Huh? After a moment of relaxation, he straightened up the pillow, sat up, and leaned on it. Opening the system backpack again, Chen Mu decided to open the F-level mission gift bag obtained by completing the task of killing the upgraded spider before, to see what rewards he could get. Select the F-level mission package and confirm to open it. Opening the F-rank mission package. Open successfully. Congratulations to the host for getting the Novice Battle Suit X1. The Novice Combat Suit, Chen Mu checked briefly and got to know it. There is a submachine gun with 300 rounds of bullets, a bulletproof vest, plus two grenades, one smoke grenade, and one flash grenade. The F-level mission gift pack, if sorted by skill level, is the weakest gift pack, and Chen Mu thinks it is pretty good to be able to get these things. If you don't awaken the second system, this gift bag will become an important supply for survival. At the same time, let him understand that it is necessary to complete the system tasks, especially the daily tasks that can obtain higher level rewards. If any gift package can provide a chance to draw a skill, even if he gets an F-level skill, for Chen Mu, it will be a bloody profit. Switch world chat channel. Randomly enter the world chat room. It's really lucky. I not only get a little kill after completing the mission, but also get an armor-piercing sniper through the gift package, but unfortunately I'm not proficient in firearms high enough. I advise you to quickly find a place to hide, and don't be obsessed with completing tasks to get gift bags. According to the official introduction, night is the craziest and bloodthirsty time for those monsters. Going outside at this time is equivalent to court deed. Hiding, hiding, is there any big brother to help me with some food? or a bottle of water, I am starving to death, if I can survive this level, I will never forget your great kindness. It's only been half a day, and nearly 100 million people have died. This world is so crazy. I really want to escape. Dot dot dot. It is not difficult to see from the constantly scrolling and refreshing chat speeches that most people have a miserable life and are not comfortable. But in such a world, comfort is a luxury, and most people are doing their best just to survive. Go to the World Trading Center. Compared with the previous post, the post may have been turned over thousands, tens of thousands of times. Firearms and equipment are of no use to Chen Mu. Instead, they take up space in his backpack. There are only 10 slots in total, all of which are hung up to exchange for food resources. 
As soon as the post was posted, it immediately attracted many comments. On the one hand, it is because there are enough people, and on the other hand, the higher the value of the exchanged items, the rarer, the higher the weight, the higher the ranking, and the higher the exposure. Weapons and ammunition, at the beginning of the end of the world, must be hard currency, so don't even think about it. I rely on it. Novice combat suit. This kind of top quality equipment, someone actually took it out to exchange things, how many resources does the boss have? Portable high precision, high speed submachine gun, 300 rounds of bullets, and comes with body armor, grenades, flash, smoke bombs, this is definitely the most arrogant post I have seen today, none of them. A box of plain bread, do you want to change it? A box of bread, or the original flavor? You don't even touch any meat, I think you are thinking about farts, the boss is not bad for resources, but it doesn't mean you can fool him for a fool. Dot dot dot, Chen Yu is not interested in the big guy who said so much. Many people have already provided all the resources they can. The system automatically sorts them by value and displays them on the right side of the screen. At this time, the first ones were two boxes of canned luncheon meat, plus one box of water. The exchange person was named Chin Lu, who sounded like a woman. Remarks. This is all I can take out. If it is not enough, I will collect food later, and I can replenish it for you. I will never break my promise. Chen Yu could tell that she needed weapons very much, and seemed to have drawn a skill that was not very suitable for combat. However, Chen Yu was not in a hurry, and planned to wait to see if anyone could come up with a more valuable exchange item than her. Soon, half an hour passed. The second and third places and after that continued to change hands, but no one surpassed the first place. Chen Yu didn't want to waste too much time on this, so he chose the first place and confirmed the transaction. The transaction is successful. Novice Battle SET1, congratulations to the host for getting two boxes of 24 cans of luncheon meat and 12 bottles of water in a box. Although there are two boxes of lunch meat, they are of the same type, occupying a backpack grid, showing 24 cans. The water and the water resources purchased by Chen Yu before killing the point share a backpack grid. This space was vacated in an instant. And in the shopping mall, Chen Yu exchanged the pistol and some bullets from the man parasitized by the face-hugging spider for a box of plain bread. The transaction was successful. Canned lunch meat two boxes, water one box, congratulations on getting the novice battle suit. Seeing the system prompt, the woman was very excited, great. I finally got the self-defense weapon. Her name was Chen Lu, and she was the one who had previously dealt with Chen Mu. The skill she drew was called Queen of Guns, and it was an E-level skill. For any gun weapon, it has a very high proficiency, continuous hits, and continuous increase in damage. In the state of holding a gun, the reaction power, observation power, also have a corresponding improvement, which is a buff skill. The Queen of Guns has no guns, and it is difficult to move an inch in the killing world. Fortunately, Chin Lu was lucky and was born in a canteen. Although the canteen had been raided, she found two boxes of canned luncheon meat and a box of water in the closet of the room on the second floor. This is what happened next. Wearing a bulletproof vest, taking out a combat submachine gun with a full magazine, the moment you hold the gun, you feel refreshed. Everything around became extremely clear. Without looking with eyes, Chin Lu could still hear the tiny sound of the bug the size of a fingernail crawling across the glass window with just her ears. Sweeping away the despair and gloom, I finally have some confidence in surviving. Thanks to Chen Mu, it's a pity that all the resources were used to exchange for weapons, and I didn't save any for myself. Now, rubbing his stomach and gurgling non-stop. Dot dot dot. Burp, Chen Mu was the complete opposite. He had just eaten two plain breads, a box of luncheon meat, and a bottle of water. Eat a full meal, whatever you like, there are plenty of resources, there is no need to save at all. If it is not enough, go out and hunt a few monsters to supplement the killing points. With dozens of killing points in Chen Emu's hands now, it is enough to enjoy himself for a long time. After eating and drinking enough, there is only one thing for him to do next, sleep. Boom, boom, quote dot 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 quote. However, just as he closed his eyes, there was an untimely explosion outside. One after another. Don't you sleep all night? Do you have to fight those monsters that are no different from spraying medicine? 
Chen Mu said he couldn't understand. Is it not good to keep growing? Do you really think you are immortal? Get up, go to the window, under the flickering light, grab it with both hands, and open the curtain with a swipe. Open the closed window again, lie on the edge of the window, and look down. An off-road vehicle was speeding ahead, and behind that, there was a crowd of people rising like a tide. Squint and look closely. What kind of crowd is that? It is clearly hundreds of thousands of zombies. It should be said to be a tide of corpses. As expected, night is the home field of these monsters. During the day, Chen Mu had never seen such a scene. This running speed is about the same as that of a normal person running at full strength, coupled with the crushing of such a huge number, anyone who sees them will probably be frightened and their legs will go weak. The most outrageous thing is that there is no limit to their physical strength. To be able to maintain this speed all the time, until death, or dawn. However, the lunatics below are an exception. Why do you say they are crazy? The reason is very simple. Under normal circumstances, when such a crisis breaks out, fleeing and avoiding war are the first choice. It's not surprising if there are advanced skill holders in the group. However, the group of people used it to kill, prevent the tide of corpses from catching up, and swallow their own as a modern weapon. Da da da, boom, 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 while crazily pulling the trigger and detonating the bomb, the lunatic laughter, coupled with all kinds of vulgar words that are extremely proud, it is not difficult to prove that they are killing for pleasure. Chen Mu originally thought to ignore it, and the group of lunatics would leave by themselves. Who would have thought that they would bring a wave of corpses and play around the glass building? Quote dot 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 quote. In such a quiet atmosphere where needles could be heard, the zombies were chasing after each other, and the RRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRR
The eyeballs overheated and exploded. Slap! It splashed on the face of the coquettishly dressed woman with more than a dozen earrings in her bare ears. Ah! Shouting, trembling all over, his voice was sharp and piercing. Your mother is dead! Yelling so loudly, the man in the driver's seat subconsciously glanced at the rearview mirror. In the end, he saw, in the mirror, a scorched and terrifying face staring straight at him. One eye has melted, and the other eye is severely swollen. Half of it was squeezed out of the eye socket. Boom! Ah! Terrified, he slammed the steering wheel and bumped his head against the electric pole. Electric poles cracked. Boom! Then it fell down and hit the front of the off-road vehicle heavily. Seeing smoke coming from the front of the car, the two quickly got out of the car. Chen Yu was busy confirming and receiving the goods. Successful kill. Congratulations, you have obtained F-level ammunition replenishment skills, which will automatically upgrade to SSS-level unlimited ammo. Congratulations, you successfully killed the player and got all the killing points owned by the opponent, killing points plus 1-0. The F-level ammunition replenishment skill is originally a skill that can automatically refill ammunition after a hit, but the chance is not high. For example, if you are lucky, 5 bullets can trigger 1 bullet replenishment. When you are unlucky, it can only be triggered once in 20 or 30 rounds. However, after the system automatically upgrades in seconds, Chen Niu, who has the SSS level infinite ammunition skill, will automatically and infinitely supply ammunition no matter what weapon he uses. Any weapon, he became a man who never had to worry about ammunition for the rest of his life. When he saw it himself, he felt perverted. Boy, it's all because of you, you ruined our car, and there are so many zombies behind, how are you going to escape? The man raised his pistol, pointed the black muzzle at Chen Mu, and asked loudly. Since you don't have that ability, don't provoke him in the first place. Chen Mu said speechlessly. What did you say? His words undoubtedly did not irritate the man. Does he not want face? The woman even added fuel to the side. Brother Pong, kill him and get more blood out. Those monsters like the smell of blood the most, so we can take this opportunity to escape. It is indeed a way. Looking at the tide of corpses gradually emerging two or three hundred meters away, Li Yunpeng pressed his hand on the trigger, already mentally preparing to empty the magazine. Um, immediately, I found that something was wrong, why I couldn't feel the existence of my fingers. In the blink of an eye, look again, the picture changes suddenly, the pistol is cut in half, and so are the fingers. Not one was spared. Ah, my hand, why are all my fingers broken? Li Yunpeng wanted to cover the wound, but suddenly realized that he had no fingers at all. I could only scream incessantly. Bend your knees and kneel down. The woman realized something was wrong, and then she recalled that her boyfriend died under a flash of fire just now. I thought Chen Mu killed her boyfriend with a flamethrower, but now I found out that he was not equipped with that kind of thing at all, and he was in a state of bare hands. Could it be that this guy is an advanced skill owner? Thinking of this, the woman didn't say much, thinking that Chen Mu had his back turned to her and couldn't see it. Looking around, after confirming the route, he opened his legs and planned to escape. Boom! Muffled! but fell to the ground. The pain rushed to the brain, and when I turned around to look again, my legs fell half a meter away, and blood was rolling. The woman is very sure that those legs wrapped in black silk and slit hip skirt are definitely her own. On the black silk, because of her boyfriend's bad taste, the traces of scratching with her fingers are exactly the same. The visual fear is so strong that even if a few front teeth are knocked off, there is no feeling. Ah, just like Li Yunpeng, he only knew how to scream. However, the woman's situation is much more serious than Li Yunpeng's. Her consciousness is rapidly fading and blurring. No, I don't want to die. Anyone is good, help me. The woman's lips were white, her hands were firmly grasping the ground, and she was crawling. In a blink of an eye, the finger was already rubbed, and it was covered with scars. Accidentally, and because of too much force, the entire fingernail of the ring finger was peeled off abruptly. But even so, he still felt nothing and crawled slowly. Chen Yu decided to give her a good time and be a holy mother. Lest you die in vain, you won't even get the skills. At least let people die meaningful and valuable. In order to own the road of invincibility, add bricks and tiles, as heavy as Mount Tai. Kuchi, an air-compressed bullet pierced through the brain without a sound. 
successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill Farsightedness, which will automatically upgrade to the SSS level skill Clairvoyance. Chen Mu sighed, it's a pity it's not night vision. Don't be complacent, those guys will catch up soon, and you won't be able to run away when the time comes. Get ready to be torn to pieces. Ha ha ha, smiling ferociously, Li Yunpeng had given up hope of surviving, and turned his head to take a look, the corpse tide is only a hundred meters away. Decided to pull Chen Mu back even if he died. Really, Chen Mu raised his arm, straight forward, aimed at the swarming zombies, twisting his body crazily, he could hear the sound of cracking bones, his mouth was open to the limit, revealing the bloody teeth of the zombies. The fireball, which was the size of a palm, swelled to a diameter of two or three meters in a few breaths, visible to the naked eye. Quote dot 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 quote. Li Yunpeng's face was indescribably dazed under the orange fire. Boom. In the next second, the fireball turned into a huge beam of light, shooting tens of meters away. Li Yunpeng turned his head slowly, his neck seemed like a machine that hadn't been oiled for many years. His eyes widened, only feeling terrified. It can be clearly seen that inside the flames, a group of human-shaped black shadows are struggling, and their flesh and blood are quickly eaten away, exposing the outline of the skeleton. In the end, together with the skeleton, it also turned into dust and disappeared. Successfully killed the zombie. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Successfully killed the zombie. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Successfully killed the zombie. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Dot dot dot. On Chen Mu's side, the system rewards were refreshed crazily, so fast that it was hard to see clearly. Hundreds of killing points, easy to get, the whole process, less than half a minute. With five fingers clenched, the flames disappeared. The world became dark again. But for a moment, Li Yunpeng saw very clearly that the asphalt road was melted and deformed due to the high temperature, and it was full of potholes made by feet, and the house was covered with burning black smoke and cracked. You, you are an S-level skill owner. Li Yunpeng finally realized that he had provoked a god of death. Wrong, it should be SSS level. For a dying person, Chen Yu has no need to keep it secret. SSS level. Without giving Li Yunpeng a chance to speak, a red line appeared on his neck, and blood beads of different sizes emerged from it. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining F-level driving proficiency and automatically upgrading to SSS level God level driving. With this skill, whether you are running on the ground, flying in the sky, or traveling in outer space, as long as Chen Mu touches the steering wheel, his proficiency will be maxed out. Hundreds of killing points, plus three new SSS level skills, it seems that being disturbed to sleep is not a bad thing. Chen Mu locked his eyes on a building next to him. Come to the top of the sixth floor. Boom, boom. Immediately afterwards, the off-road vehicle exploded behind him. After several transfers, I returned to the hotel room. Ha, huh, he let out a long breath, and now, the whole world is quiet. Chen Mu was able to fall asleep smoothly. This night, his sleep quality was as good as ever, and it hasn't changed because of his rebirth into the killing world. Just after dawn, Chen Yu opened his eyes, sat up, and stretched himself. Twisting the neck, the bone made a slight sound. He is used to sleeping on a hard bed, so he is somewhat uncomfortable with the hotel's super soft mattress. Looking around again, no traces of intrusion were found. Everything is normal. Open the system mall, is there no daily necessities such as toothpaste and toothbrush? Or, the system, you never imagined that someone would have the luxury to brush their teeth and wash their face the next day, living a refined life. For this kind of question, the system will naturally not give an answer. There is no way, Chen Yu can only open the trading center, post a post, and exchange a can of meat for toothbrush and toothpaste. Since there is such a condition, why not enjoy it? As soon as the post was issued, it immediately caused a violent response. Brush your teeth, good guy, I'm still worrying about having nothing to eat, but I'm thinking about how to ensure my personal health. A canned meat, so hungry, this name is so familiar, it seems to be the boss who exchanged the novice battle suit for food yesterday. Boss, please hug your thighs, I'm a cute girl, I only need three cans and a bottle of water a day, and I can warm your bed every day. Can't the upstairs be more reserved? 
I am Oni San, a nine headed Chongsam, and I need a canned food less than upstairs every day. Dot dot dot. Chen Niu was speechless, all he wanted was toothpaste and a toothbrush. The two girls never dreamed that in the Heian era, as a heartthrob, they were not as important as toothpaste and toothbrush in killing the world. If you post it upside down, people don't even care about it. Finally, after seven minutes, Chen Niu saw an option appeared in the list. One Fei Yang soft bristled toothbrush and one green tea mint toothpaste. Confirm the exchange. Successful exchange. Canned MEAT1. Congratulations to the host for obtaining a Fei Yang soft bristled toothbrush and a green tea mint toothpaste. 220 grams. This number of grams is not too small in toothpaste. Look at the date. It seems that they don't know what month and day it is in this world. Anyway, it looked quite clean, so I unpacked the plastic package, opened the carton, took out the toothpaste, took out the toothbrush, and squeezed a little. Open the system backpack, take out a bottle of mineral water, rinse your mouth first, then brush up and down, left and right, carefully. The toothpaste tastes good, and it doesn't make Chen Mu feel sick and want to vomit. Brush for two minutes, rinse your mouth with half a bottle of water, and rehydrate with half a bottle of water. At this time the sun was fully up, and the light just shone on Chen Mu. Warm, with a mouthful of green tea and mint flavor, this life is comfortable. Just woke up, not very hungry yet, Chen Mu thought about having breakfast later. Compared to that, I am more curious. The mailbox reminder in the upper right corner of the field of vision has been flashing frequently. Open, heaven and earth rankings have been announced. Time, 12 o'clock in the morning. Tianbang, land list. Chapter 11, Chen Niu thought that only games would set up lists, but he didn't expect to see them even in this place. Apart from comparing and stimulating the player's desire to kill, Chen Niu couldn't think of any other functions. I still decided to open it and have a look to understand the overall combat effectiveness of tens of billions of people in the current world. Tianbang, Personal Combat Power Ranking, Ground Ranking, Daily Kill Ranking. Note. The Tianbang and Debang are updated on time at 12 o'clock in the morning every day, and the rewards are settled. The list only shows the top 100. If the ranking accounts for the top 10% of the total number of people, you can get rewards. The higher the ranking, the richer the rewards, the specific rewards shall prevail. There are rewards. Saying this, Chen Niu will not be sleepy anymore, and he will immediately feel refreshed. After reading the introduction, open the list first. The name of the first place is so familiar that it can no longer be familiar. First place, Chen Mu, number of kills, 1008. I also want to know, one wave came from the mall, and the other wave came from the corpse tide before going to bed last night. Thanks to those lunatics who stayed up for three nights and walked zombies outside. In fact, even without them, Chen Mu can still secure the first place. The reason is very simple. The number of kills in the second place is only 18, which is a huge difference. A cliff-like plunge. Do you want to receive rewards for being on the list? Receive. Without hesitation. Successful collection. Congratulations to the host for obtaining a copy of the current city resource map. After receiving the reward, this resource map is automatically injected into the system, and a new icon is opened. Just click, you can look at the entire city. All resource points, regardless of food, weapons and ammunition, are all marked and can be navigated. Chen Niu thinks this is a very good reward. Then, open the list again. The first place is still no suspense. First place, Chen Niu. No more data to show, just a name. Do you want to receive the reward for being on the top list? Receive. Successful collection. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the Elite Difficulty Trial Card X1. Trial card. Select view details. Elite difficulty trial card. It can open the key to the elite difficulty trial land. After clearing the level, you can get a lot of special and unique rewards. Note, before the mission is successful, you cannot leave. Seeing this supplementary reminder, Chen Mu once wondered, is this thing really a reward? If you don't have a clear understanding of your own strength, if you use the trial card, you will either be trapped forever or die. But this special and unique reward is quite attractive to Chen Mu. 8 SSS level skills, shouldn't be able to pass even an elite difficulty mission level. Open the system backpack, 
clicked on the Elite Difficulty Trial card, and saw the words, Use, and, Cancel, that popped up, Chen Mu hesitated. A little carelessness, my life will go straight away. The system will release daily tasks in three minutes, players please get ready. Just as Chen Mu was hesitating, a new system prompt popped up. The trial card is not used now and will not expire. Daily tasks are different. Chen Mu decided to grasp the present moment first and give himself more confidence to break through the barrier. Not long, three minutes is up. Daily missions have been released. Players are requested to go to the designated location and complete the killing missions to get rewards. Is it 4,300 meters? It's not close. Chen Mu studied this mission carefully. The mission location is in an abandoned chemical factory, and the number of kills is one, which is an upgraded creature. The word, upgraded creature, is too vague. Any monster in this world, even zombies, can be called an upgraded creature. The most important thing is that this daily task is different from the previous one, and it is not limited to a single person, that is to say, you can form a team. After forming a team, everyone will share rewards. As long as one person completes the kill, it will be deemed that all members have completed the task, and the number of rewards won will remain the same. System conscience, or is the risk factor of this task itself higher than before? Chen Mu no longer thought about it, and saw the farthest distance at a glance. Brush it, falling on the roof of a three-story concrete building, at this moment, it is more than 2,000 meters. Then through continuous teleportation, approach the coordinate point. It takes at least an hour for a person to travel at a normal speed, but Chen Mu took less than three minutes. After arriving, it was discovered that more than a dozen people were blocked outside the abandoned factory and could not enter. After Chen Mu came to the crowd, he found a random person, patted his shoulder, and asked, what's going on inside? A guild called Blood Wolf said that this task is exclusive to them, and no one is allowed to participate. The man suppressed his anger and explained to Chen Mu. Then can't you join them? Chen Mu asked again. Yes, E-level skills, whether they are combat skills or not, can be added, but F-level skills like ours are not combat skills, and they are not of much use. People simply look down on them. The man said, Lee, full of dissatisfaction. For daily missions, he specially spent a lot of money and bought a pistol at the first kill point. Who knows, in the end, the hero is useless. There are so many people, why don't you break in together? Chen Mu asked around, asking about the situation in the factory. Hey, there are D-level supernatural beings in the guild. What's the use of having a group of F-level people? If you really want to fight, what's the difference between sending leaks to your door for others to harvest? The man sighed helplessly. A superhuman, Chen Mu didn't continue to ask, preventing the man from protesting. At the same time, more and more people arrived. When you know the F-level combat skills, or the skills that can be used, you can apply to join the Blood Wolf Guild. After sharing the mission results, many people raised their hands and shouted, Me. Me. Some of them are true and some are false. Of course, the people of the Blood Wolf Guild are not stupid. After they are put in the door, there will be verification. The fakers, regardless of begging for mercy, howling, beat them to death, and throw them out like a dead dog to deter others. At present, there is no sound in the abandoned factory, not at all. The members of the Blood Wolf Guild did not act in a hurry, obviously wanting to take this opportunity to recruit a few more potential members. It is indeed a kind of wisdom. Chen Mu decided to use this group of people first to try the depth of this task. Be careful and live long. Squeezing out of the crowd and coming to the door, he said with a half-hearted smile, I am an E-level power user. E-level, the gatekeeper looked at Chen Mu suspiciously. Finally opened the door, you'd better not lie to me, otherwise, be careful I break your leg. Chen Mu didn't say anything, and walked in along the door that only allowed one person to pass through. The man who had talked with Chen Mu just now was a little surprised after seeing all this, I didn't expect him to be an E-level power user. Hee <laughs> hee, what E-level supernatural powers are, they must be a lie. Where are there so many E-levels? I think he will be beaten to death soon, and then thrown out. That's right, as an E-level power user, he feels too kind and approachable. Kind approachable, if they didn't say anything, Chen Mu wouldn't know that in the eyes of outsiders, he was such a gentle and refined image. 
Boy, what skill have you awakened? Hurry up and use it to see, don't waste time. The inch-cut youth clenched the plastic rod in his hand and was mentally prepared for some physical labor. Here, Chen Niu asked for confirmation. Otherwise where do you want to be? The inch-cut young man stared and said, it's stupid. Chen Niu stopped talking and raised his hand. The young man with a cropped head narrowed his eyes and stared at Chen Emu's palm, but he didn't see anything. He thought that he was dazzled and short-sighted, and was about to get closer. Boom, a raging fire arose directly. Chen Niu casually threw the fireball into an empty metal bucket ten meters away. Boom, boom, there was an explosion on the spot, the sound was like thunder, and the metal bucket was shaken to a height of seven or eight meters. When everyone looked up, the metal bucket was torn to pieces. Quote dot 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 quote. The young man with a cropped head was so frightened that he fell to the ground, his legs were weak, and his crotch was wet. Almost hit the scythe of death. Sent to the underworld to report. He really awakened the E-level skills, who said it was fake. If he is not an E-level superhuman, then what is it? Hearing these questioning voices, the few people who shouted the most fiercely just retreated from the crowd, not wanting to be set on fire. They also didn't expect that Chen Mu was really an E-level skill holder. Clap clap. At this moment, applause rang out. A man in a windbreaker walked towards Chen Mu and said with a smile, Pretty. Your move is so beautiful. I declare that from now on, you will officially become a member of our Blood Wolf family. He raised his hand and patted Chen Emu's shoulders a few times, I appreciate you very much, don't let me down later. Hearing what Chen Mu said, he always felt that the man in the windbreaker wanted to train himself to be his right-hand man. Who are you? Chen Mu confirmed the other party's identity. Idiot, you have no eyesight. This is Dao Yang from our Blood Wolf Guild, Vice President Dao. Hurry up and thank you. The inch cut young man blamed. Quote dot 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 quote. When Dao Yang heard this, the expression on his face changed instantly. Immediately, he kicked hard on the chest of the short haired young man. This kick directly sent the inch headed youth flying seven or eight meters away. Then, Dao Yang asked with a cold face, who allowed you to talk to my brother like that? Yes, I'm sorry. The inch-cut young man put his hand on his chest and immediately apologized. A stream of blood dripped from the corner of his lips, but he didn't bother to wipe it off. Little brother, don't mind if the dog isn't tied properly. After finally getting an E-rank rookie, Dao Yang didn't want the cooked duck to fly away because of the rude behavior of the crop-head youth. It's okay. Chen Mu shook his head. Okay, big brother. Dao Yang gave a thumbs up. Then he said, Operate yourself, join the team, and the mission will start immediately. He did not fool Chen Mu with his words. After confirming that there was no suitable candidate, Dao Yang immediately ordered his two subordinates to open the warehouse door. Chen Mu took a glance, excluding himself, there were a total of 20 people inside the factory wall. Quote dot 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 quote. Clenching his fists, Chen Emu's hands were already itching. His eyes returned to the two people who were in charge of opening the door. One person put his hands against one side of the big iron gate, and the two looked at each other. After nodding, they pushed in with all their strength at the same time. Buzz buzz. Because there was no activity for too long, the hinges were seriously rusted and difficult to open, and the sound was really loud, like beating gongs and drums, extremely ear-piercing. After a while, the iron gate was opened about two meters, and if it was pushed again, it would not move. Vice President, I can't push anymore. Someone shouted. Go in and have a look. Dao Yang pointed. Although the two looked reluctant, they could only do what he said. As the lowest guild member, he has no right to choose. If you do it, you may die in the hands of monsters. If you don't do it, you will die in Dao Yang's hands 100%. The two entered the factory one after the other. One minute, two minutes, three minutes later, there was still no news. Dao Yang couldn't wait any longer, and shouted, If you're not dead, tell me what's going on inside. Hello. Seeing that no one responded to him, Dao Yang stepped forward again and shouted. Boom, boom. Then, the iron door was knocked down, and two human cannonballs flew out from the warehouse curry. He fell not far from Chen Emu's side. The waist and abdomen were directly pinched and severely deformed and twisted. Eyes, mouth, the seven orifices are bleeding. Not dead yet, 
at least still breathing, body trembling. With such a wide fingerprint, one can imagine how huge its owner would be. When everyone was not paying attention and their eyes were on the dark warehouse curry, Chen Mu bent his fingers in the hand hidden behind his back, separated two threads, and wrapped them around their necks. With the index finger and middle finger, hook it hard again, and it will be cut off on the spot. A red line appeared on the throat, and a row of blood beads of different sizes squeezed out. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level arrow splitting skill, which will be automatically upgraded to SSS level arrows. Originally, with the F-level arrow splitting skill, one arrow could be split into two, causing twice the damage. But after SSS level strengthening, one arrow can turn 10,000 arrows. The system still fully interprets the word, abnormal. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level hidden weapons skill and automatically upgrading to an SSS-level hidden weapons master. At the very beginning of the mission, Chen Mu took advantage of the momentum to harvest two SSS-level skills, not to mention how cool it was. Then, he turned his attention to the factory. The growl was astonishing. The light inside the factory was very dim, and after the two iron doors were destroyed, a lot of light came in. People can clearly see what kind of monster it is that seriously injured the two of them. A giant, a giant with a round head and fat brain, muscular body, and a waist as thick as two people with just one leg. There are iron shackles on the feet, and a pair of iron gloves on the hands, which are also connected by an iron chain as thick as an arm. When walking, there will be a crashing sound. There is a metal respirator over the mouth, covering most of the face. Wearing iron trousers on the lower body. There are two thick tubes inserted into the back, from the shoulders to the lower back. The rest are all flesh-colored, exposed to the air, with clear lines, exploding to terrifying muscles. It is no exaggeration to describe it as a mountain of muscles. The height alone is three or four meters. No matter how you look at those blood-red eyes, they don't look like a person. Giant zombie. Chen Mu is not sure. Everyone, spread out in a circle. Pay attention to absorbing hatred. Dao Yang reacted quickly and ordered the remaining people. Chen Mu pretended to act. Dao Yang finally took off his windbreaker, which in Chen Mu's opinion, was in the way. Then, someone stepped forward and handed a large European-style sword to Dao Yang with both hands. Modern cold weapon. If Chen Mu's guess is correct, Dao Yang's awakened skill should be swordsmanship. At this stage, those with strong skills must have a higher level in the guild, because there is not so much time to test a person's leadership. Therefore, it is more convenient and faster to use skills as the standard, and it is easier to convince others. Chen Mu is 100% sure that Dao Yang is exactly those people who have awakened D-level skills according to legend. D-level skill swordsmanship, Chen Mu wanted to meet him very much. See if there is any collection value. Various abilities, miscellaneous, abilities such as flames and ice are relatively common. However, because it is only F rank, in terms of power, it is not even qualified to tickle giant zombies. At most, it attracts hatred. As for the ice technique, the legs had just been frozen with a thin layer of ice, and when they lifted their feet, they were smashed to pieces and had no effect. There are also some skills that can speed up the speed of bullets and enhance lethality, or increase defense and resist blows. Not to mention how bright it is. What Chen Mu looked forward to the most was Dao Yang, and his eyes were focused on him alone. I saw him holding the hilt with the design of the sun element in his hand, pulling out a large silver sword at least two meters long from the scabbard, holding the sword with one hand, standing sideways, waiting, still waiting, waiting for the best opportunity to attack. Even though two or three people had already died under the giant zombie's iron fist, and were smashed to a bloody mess, Dao Yang's face still showed no signs of emotion. Dot dot dot. Finally, Dao Yang found the opportunity and rushed forward quickly, holding swords in both hands, and came behind the giant zombie. At this very moment, the giant zombie was locking onto other people, raising its arms high, ready to throw its iron fist. The man curled up in the corner, trembling, his face was as pale as gray, and tears glistened in his eyes, which might burst out at any moment. At this time, with a flash of coldness, Dao Yang cut down the big sword held high in both hands. Cut off the right arm of the giant zombie. Boom. The thick arm like a support pillar fell heavily to the ground, raising a lot of smoke and dust. 
Cough, cough, cough. The man who choked and gasped, curled up in the corner, sucked in a lot of dust, and coughed. Oh, is it also related to the ice? Chen Yu could see clearly that Dao Yang's sword was covered with a layer of frost. The broken arm on the shoulder of the giant zombie was also sealed to death by the ice. In this regard, the giant zombie directly raised his left arm, crushed the layer of cold ice, then picked up the broken arm, and crushed the incision sealed by ice. Then hit the shoulder, and countless granulation sprouts grew densely at the fracture, connecting the shoulder to the arm. And then, the severed arm healed with the momentum visible to the naked eye. This, Dao Yang obviously encountered such a zombie monster for the first time, and his face showed a look of astonishment. The hatred of the giant zombies was successfully transferred because of his sword. He turned around abruptly, raised his arm horizontally, and used the turning force of the turn to superimpose the powerful force of the arm itself, and slammed at Dao Yang fiercely. Not good. Dao Yang knew he couldn't dodge it, so he quickly straightened the sword, held the hilt backwards with one hand, and pushed the sword horizontally with the other, using the sword as a shield to block in front of him. Boom, boom, the result can be imagined, he was directly knocked into the air more than 10 meters away, and crashed into a pile of discarded metal barrels. The sound was messy, the tin barrels flew around, and there were several seriously deformed ones. Chen Mu was a little surprised. He didn't expect that Dao Yang was still alive under this kind of attack. He supported his body tremblingly with his sword. Then, his lips opened and closed, and he was muttering something, and a green light descended from the top of his head. Dao Yang recovered to his full state, and he didn't look like he had been seriously injured. Is this also part of the skill? Chen Niu became more and more interested. Boom, 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 the footsteps were heavy, and the iron chain whipped the ground. Seeing that Dao Yang was still alive, the giant zombie rushed towards him with big strides like a mad cow. This scene, just looking at it, is terrifying enough, whoever dares to step forward to stop it, chooses to retreat one after another. A bunch of useless waste. Dao Yang raised his sword with both hands again, the hilt was raised above his head, and the blade was almost stuck to his back. After confirming that the giant zombie has entered the attack range, he raised his sword fiercely at 360 degrees and swung it down. This sword, no matter the speed or the sense of power, is full. The muscles of Dao Yang's arms holding the sword bulged, and the lines, like steel bars, looked terrifying. Boom, it's just that this sword, which looked powerful, was easily blocked by the giant zombie with an iron glove. Not to mention breaking the defense, it just left a tiny, hair-thin cut mark on it. How could this be? There was no smile on Dao Yang's face, and his confidence collapsed. This task is even more difficult than he imagined, at least two or three levels higher. The giant zombie raised his right arm. The iron fist of his right hand was different from his left hand. The left hand could not be opened, but the five fingers of his right hand could move freely like humans. He squeezed the blade and drew it violently. Dao Yang couldn't hold back the sudden force, he could only watch helplessly as the great sword flew tens of meters away and plunged into a third of the ground. Quote dot 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 quote. The shadow in front of him enlarged, and the field of vision was almost completely occupied by the giant zombie's iron fist. You, what are you doing in a daze? Hurry up and use your skills. Dao Yang glanced at Chen Mu who was still watching the show, rolling and crawling, dodging the attack while not forgetting to urge. I just remembered that I forgot to ask his name just now. Chen Yu also felt that the timing was about the same, everything that needed to be understood was already understood, it was time to enter the battlefield and start harvesting. Raise your hand, a fireball forms, half a meter in diameter. When seeing the fireball grow to a diameter of one meter, the rest of the people were delighted and felt that it was possible to fight back. When they saw that the diameter of the fireball had increased to two meters, they began to panic and feel uneasy, worried that they might hurt themselves. When they saw the diameter of the fireball soaring to three meters, they ran away like mice, and they were able to stay away from ten meters, never 9.9 .9 meters. I'm afraid I can't avoid it, and it will be melted in one piece. At the same time, a big question arose in his heart, is this really an E-level skill? It doesn't look like, it doesn't look like it. Or is it purely just looking bluffing? But in fact, it is strong on the outside but capable on the inside. Boom. 
Just when they were thinking wildly, Chen Mu cooperated with the compressed air skill to instantly release and propel the fireball, speeding up the movement speed of the fireball. The speed was so fast that the group didn't even have time to see clearly. Then turn your head and look around. It was discovered that the bottom of the wall on the left side of the factory was pierced by a fireball, and a magma-colored liquid was still dripping down. Immediately, the factory lost its support and suddenly collapsed. You call this an E-level skill. As for the giant zombies, I didn't see it, but if you look closely, you can see that in the burning traces along the way, you can see two areas that are not stained with carbon black, which are shaped like a pair of souls. After realizing this, a terrifying thought could not help popping up in everyone's minds. That giant zombie, wouldn't it be melted in an instant to the point where there were no bones left? Is this really the power that an E-level skill should have? How is this possible? Dao Yang's D-level skills can't help that giant zombie at all, okay. If E-level skills are stronger than D-level skills, why are there different skill levels? Why don't you take off your pants and fart? Regardless of proficiency. In terms of proficiency, no matter how you look at it, Dao Yang showed more. Chen Mu just raised his arms to condense the fireball, that's all. Or was he deliberately hiding something? Successfully killed the giant zombie. Congratulations to Speed for getting 5 kill points. The killing mission has been completed. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the E-level mission package. Chen Mu really cared more about what he saw than what they thought. The task is easily completed, and the gift bag reward is in hand. Dao Yang got up from the ground in embarrassment, he is not a fool, the matter has developed to such an extent, how could he not see that Chen Mu deceived himself? You, who are you? Also puzzled were the onlookers gathered behind the railing door. They have already given up the idea of participating in the mission, and if they go in, they will die. This is absolutely impossible to be an E-level skill, right? Nonsense. Your E-level skill can instantly kill such a big monster. It's too strong, at least A-level, or even S-level. S-level. Impossible. I haven't heard of anyone awakening S-level skills, so isn't he a rare existence? Dot dot dot. Regardless of whether Chen Mu is an S-level skill holder or not, after witnessing his terrifying performance, some people are already thinking about how to hug his thigh. It's not important. Chen Mu didn't intend to reveal his identity. So as not to increase the disaster in vain. Boss, it's very strange, our mission failed. Yeah, why did the mission fail? The mission target has been killed, the mission failed. Needless to say, Dao Yang can see it himself. He gestured to one of his subordinates with his eyes, quickly ran to pick up the big sword that fell in the distance, and brought it back for himself. Holding the hilt of the sword, pointed at Chen Mu, at the same time, a green light descended, and Dao Yang regained his full state again, and all the exposed wounds on his body disappeared. From this, it is not difficult for Chen Mu to judge that the sword is the skill itself. You didn't form a team with us? Dao Yang asked. Why should I form a team with you? Chen Mu asked back. Quote dot 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 quote. Dao Yang still wanted to say something, but he stopped talking. Seeing more than a dozen people point their guns at him under the command of his eyes, and their skills are ready to go, Chen Mu couldn't help laughing, I dare not point their guns at monsters, but dare to aim and kill them. Is it me? That kind of skill, if I'm right, you can't activate it frequently, right? Dao Yang said his own conjecture. Such a killer move, if there is no limit on the number of times it can be used, why would Chen Mu make such a big circle, design it, and entrap himself? Seeing that Chen Mu didn't speak, Dao Yang raised the corner of his lips, knowing that he had guessed right. The sound of bullets being loaded continued to be heard. Dao Yang asked again, are you handing over your resources yourself, or do you want to go all the way to the dark? What makes you think that you can kill me? Chen Mu asked curiously. Your skills are no longer usable. With so many of us, one shot per person can turn you into a sieve. Dao Yang said confidently. I advise you that it's better to catch it with nothing. You have to thank yourself for your good luck. I'm willing to give you another chance to be an ox and a horse for me. Sorry, I refuse. Chen Mu replied without thinking. Looking for death. Dao Yang raised his hand and pointed his sword at Chen Mu, his silver teeth clenched, rubbed and rattled. For Chen Mu, he has completely lost his patience. Seeing Chen Mu raised his arms to both sides, 
Dao Yang sneered, are you thinking about surrendering now? Ah, ah, quote dot 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 quote. The corners of his lips twitched. Hearing the strange noises coming from his ears, Dao Yang frowned, turned his head away, and said impatiently, what are you yelling? In the end, it was seen that everyone was lifted off the ground like puppets on a string, out of control. I can't breathe smoothly, and I can't make a sound, so I can only make noisy and strange noises. Ten fingers digging at the neck, kicking his legs desperately, but nothing can be changed. Dao Yang could see clearly that there seemed to be an invisible thread wrapped around their necks, strangling the flesh half a centimeter. His eyes quickly returned to Chen Mu, and before he could speak, he saw his little finger move. Bang, bang, bang. Several people fell to the ground and made a muffled noise. It's just that the head and body are a little, far away. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill flame breathing technique, which automatically upgrades to SSS level dragon flame breath. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining F-level skill freezing, which will automatically upgrade to SSS level frost realm. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill bullet acceleration, which is automatically upgraded to SSS level unlimited acceleration. Three SSS level skills are just a matter of moving your fingertips. Hey, what's the situation? Why are those people floating in midair? You ask me, who do I ask? I still want to know. That kid must have done the right thing. Before the necks of those people were cut off, I noticed that his little finger moved. Ah, move your little finger and kill three people in the air. What kind of perverted skill is this? The big fireball skill just now hasn't been explained yet. Why did a heaven-defying skill pop up again? Could it be that he is the owner of the double S skill? Double S skill owner. Heard these words again. Google. Dao Yang swallowed. He never thought that one day, he would become an enemy of this kind of monster. At this time, Chen Emu's right ring finger moved again. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill Shadow Step, which automatically upgrades to the SSS level ghost movement technique. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill Heat Sensing Eyes, which are automatically upgraded to SSS level magic eyes. This magic pupil is exactly the skill that Chen Mu has dreamed of for a long time. Not only can see through the cold and heat sensor, but also can turn the day into daylight, without fear of darkness. Guilt. Why feel guilty? They also turned their guns on themselves. If the person who died was themselves, how would they feel guilty? As for the reason of following orders, Chen Mu did not accept it. The killing is still going on. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for getting F-level skill defense improvement, automatically upgraded to SSS level golden body indestructible. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill draw sword slash, which will automatically upgrade to SSS level unlimited sword draw slash. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill water spray, which will automatically upgrade to SSS level Tianshui birth of the world. Stop. Stop. In front of own, Chen Mu regards himself as heir, does not exist, and slaughters own people wantonly. What does Dao Yang hate? I hate my body that can't stop shaking. Even though I hate myself, I only dare to speak in a low voice. I never thought that own's reckless behavior would actually attract a killing god. He even felt that all this was a complete trap from the very beginning. I have been tricked, and everyone has been tricked. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill control technique, which will be automatically upgraded to SSS level control technique. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill to hide and live, and it will automatically upgrade to SSS level complete invisibility. Since then, except for Dao Yang, all members of the Blood Wolf Guild present have been beheaded by Chen Mu. No more, no less, a total of 10 SSS level skills. Too many people died under the iron fist of giant zombies. Chen Mu suddenly regretted it, why didn't he act earlier, and lost a lot of SSS level skills in vain. Fortunately, everything is bad in this world, except the player. Okay, next, it's your turn. Chen Mu turned his gaze back to Dao Yang. The good stuff, of course, is saved for last. Chen Mu is looking forward to what surprises he can bring to himself. 
There's no need to kill them all, right? I admit that my previous attitude was a bit bad, but it's not a crime that deserves death. Chen Emu's expressionless face made Dao Yang, who has always been good at observing words and expressions, feel a little uneasy. Seeing that Chen Mu didn't speak, he raised his weird hand that could kill people invisible. Dao Yang's breath began to become short, his chest heaved and heaved, his hand subconsciously clenched the sword and held it obliquely in front of him. Loudly, it can even be said to be roaring. Don't kill me, I can help you sit as the president of the Blood Wolf Guild, how about it? Is this the head office? Chen Mu still didn't speak, but Dao Yang was eloquent, squeezed out a smile, and kept saying, Blood Wolf Guild is not small now, with more than a hundred members. I believe that with your strength, you can sitting on the throne of the president and developing the guild into the number one in the world will definitely not be a problem. Since I have this strength, what do I need you for? Quote dot 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 quote. Chen Mu asked Dao Yang with a word. The smile was just a wry smile, a self-deprecating smile. It seems that I will die here 90% today. Dao Yang twisted his wrist as he spoke, so that the palm of his hand could fit closer to the hilt of the sword. So as not to let go, affect the performance. It's 100%. Chen Mu corrected. Don't underestimate people. Dao Yang rushed forward, intending to seize the opportunity and win the remaining 10% chance of winning. In his opinion, there should be a 90% difference between himself and Chen Mu. Boom. However, as soon as the foot was stepped out, the existence of the limbs could not be felt, and the person fell straight down and hit the ground. Turning his head sideways, he could see the arm holding the sword in the distance. The speed was so fast that at this moment, the blood reacted and flowed out from the incision. What happened? Dao Yang didn't know it. This time, he didn't even notice Chen Emu's move. In fact, Chen Mu didn't take the initiative to attack, but just used those invisible, air-compressed transparent wires, coupled with unlimited acceleration skills, the reason is equivalent to a high-frequency vibration wire saw. It was Dao Yang who bumped into it himself and cut off Ohn's hands and feet. It was also at this moment that Dao Yang realized that he didn't even have a 0.01 chance of winning from the beginning to the end. This is a unilateral massacre. Don't you need your healing skills? Chen Mu asked curiously. That can only heal ordinary injuries. There is no way to treat serious injuries like this. Please give me a good time. After Dao Yang explained, he closed his eyes. Chen Mu raised his hand, and on top of Dao Yang's head, a long knife imperceptible to the naked eye condensed. Hand down, knife down. One hit kill, successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining a D-level paladin and automatically upgrading to an SSS-level angel paladin. Paladin, foreign stuff. Chen Mu took a rough look. The original D-level paladin skill can summon a paladin sword with a frost effect on the blade. At the same time, the paladin skill also comes with primary healing skills. After being upgraded to an SSS Angel Paladin, Chen Mu can summon the Radiant Holy Sword and ride the Radiant Pegasus. And the primary healing skills have also been strengthened into Angelic Blessings. How exaggerated is this Angel Blessing healing skill? To put it bluntly, as long as Chen Mu has one breath left, he can still return to his original state in a second. Dao Yang did not disappoint him. Seeing a guild, so many people were beheaded out of thin air by Chen Mu, and I didn't even understand what method was used. The people outside the door didn't dare to stay any longer, they fled in all directions like mice, for fear that Chen Mu would catch everyone's attention and not let anyone go. Not impossible. In fact, Chen Mu does not want to become a machine that only knows how to kill. Killing decisively does not mean that he will kill indiscriminately. Not caring about those people, Chen Mu opened the system backpack, selected the E-Level Mission gift bag, and confirmed to open it. Opening the E-Level Mission package. Open successfully. Congratulations to the host for getting free attribute points plus 10. Attribute points. Chen Mu is no stranger to this thing. He has never eaten pork. Haven't he seen a pig run? Attributes can be said to be very common settings in games, such as strength attributes, speed attributes, dodge attributes, defense attributes. However, in the world of killing, the effect of attribute points is not bad, and can enhance all aspects of one's own attributes. The word random means that there is no limit to the type of attribute increase, which can be increased freely. These 10 free attributes, 
Chen Emu's balance of rain and dew, strength, speed, dodge, defense, endurance, all come with one or two points. After adding attributes, you can clearly feel that even without skills, this body is quite different from before. The movement is lighter, the punching force is greater, and the muscles have become much tighter. This reward is not bad. Chen Emu's eyes lit up. Anyway, it is much better than weapons. Those things are really useless to Chen Mu. Heavy weapons like Gatling and shells are another matter. Ha, huh. withdrawing his thoughts, Chen Mu opened the system backpack again, focusing on the elite trial card. Holding more than a dozen SSS level skills in his hands, especially the skill of Angel Paladin, Chen Mu thought to himself, even if there is no way to instantly kill it, I can kill it by force, right? No more hesitation, click to confirm the use of the elite trial card. Immediately, a black card with an incomprehensible golden rune engraved appeared in Chen Emu's hand. The method of use has been automatically instilled in his mind. The index finger and middle finger clamped it, and flew out. Just like a mosaic in midair, it disappeared piece by piece. Then, a whirlpool door appeared in front of Chen Mu. What's inside can't see clearly. After another deep breath, Chen Mu walked in. The back foot landed, and the whirlpool door disappeared. Looking up and looking around, he came to a street. It is no different from the street environment of the previous city, dilapidated, full of despair, and quiet. There are also several high-rise buildings that have been burnt pitch black with obvious traces, the windows are all broken, and glass shards are scattered all over the place. Chen Mu was vigilant about his surroundings, not daring to take it lightly. Suddenly, I noticed that a centipede crawled out of the manhole cover hole at my feet. He raised his foot, intending to trample it to death. But at this time, the sense of crisis reminded Chen Wei that he could not do that. There is no way, just to be on the safe side, condense an air knife, drop it down, and cut it in half. The disconnected body was still twisting, throwing out green blood. After the blood flowed to the ground, white bubbles and white smoke quickly appeared, bringing a strong sulfur smell. Now, Chen Yu finally understood why the crisis response was triggered. The blood of this centipede is extremely corrosive. A small centipede that was as long as a finger, the blood corroded a hole the size of a tennis ball. This little centipede is the elite boss. How is this possible? Suddenly there was a burst of noisy sound under the manhole cover, and then the manhole cover was jacked up. Boom, it seems that because of insufficient strength, he fell back again. Boom, 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 so repeated, each time higher than the top. At the same time, around the manhole cover and the edge of the hole, centipedes are densely packed, gushing out of it like a tide. Finally, boom, the well cover was completely overturned, and a large number of centipedes erupted in a blowout style, rushing up to a height of 2 or 3 meters, and falling like dense raindrops. Just looking at this scene gives people goosebumps and creeps. After landing, the group of centipedes quickly adjusted their posture and turned to Chen Mu, as if he had a GPS tracker installed on his body and gathered. Chen Mu didn't want to be touched by these guys. If he was bitten, the corrosive venom would enter the blood, and it would probably burn through the bones instantly. For their corrosive ability, Chen Mu did not have the slightest doubt. The group of centipedes was about to touch Chen Mu's toes, but in the next second, Chen Mu quickly moved away and appeared 20 to 30 meters away. The tide of centipedes did not stop for a moment, rushing in hot pursuit. Chen Mu had already prepared a big meal, and just waited for the opponent to enter the attack range, raised his hand, and suddenly dropped it. At the same time, a large fireball with a diameter of 5 or 6 meters fell. The fireball hit the tide of centipedes, instantly turning thousands of centipedes into coke. Boom! Then, the fireball exploded, and the flames spread in all directions. There were no dead ends at 365, setting off a wave of fire 2 or 3 meters high, eroding wildly, and engulfing the army of centipedes. Expanding with heat and contracting with cold, the body of the centipede exploded, and the sound of crackling and crackling could be heard one after another. It's a pity that these guys are so weak that they are not within the scope of killing rewards. Otherwise, it is estimated that the system will be maxed out, and at least hundreds of thousands of killing points will be credited. Boom, 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 boom. At this moment, Chen Mu turned into a flame mage, continuously condensing large fireballs in the air, and continuously falling down. 
Although it was not as dense as raindrops, the scene was several times more shocking than the pouring rain. The fire blazed into the sky, dyeing Chen Emu's visible range with a strange orange-red. The charcoal ash formed from the bodies of the centipedes raised the ground by more than 10 centimeters. Chen Yu couldn't remember how many fireballs he dropped, at least three digits. It was only then that the terrifying centipede wave was finally suppressed. The wellhead no longer blows out, and the crawling speed slows down hundreds of times, only a few sporadic ones, a dozen or so. There is nothing to be afraid of at all. Is it over? Chen Yu always felt that it was a bit too relaxed. But the tide of centipedes would be difficult for most people to resist. Hundreds of thousands of centipedes with strong corrosive blood, the skill level is fine, if the skills are not strong, just rely on modern weapons, hundreds of thousands of bullets. Not realistic at all. Da da da, da da da, the strange, continuous sound of hard objects hitting the ground came suddenly. It's like stereo surround sound. Something is around. And it's a big deal. Crisis sensing. Chen Mu reacted quickly and teleported 10 meters away. Boom. Where Chen Mu was standing, two silver blades two to three meters long popped out of the ground, cutting an X-shaped cut. It's fast, almost in the blink of an eye. A second later, it is very likely to be broken into several large pieces. Then the ground arched and fell on both sides. Exposing it, a huge centipede with red back, silver belly, centipedes, standing five or six meters high and twenty meters in length appeared in front of Chen Mu. Its head is somewhat similar to that of a king cobra. It is a large piece and looks quite hard. The most terrifying thing is that it has a flat human face. The silvery jaws opened and closed, full of fangs. And the two long knives just now were actually its forelimbs. In addition to these two long knives forelimbs, there is another pair of silver saber forelimbs at a slightly lower position, but they are slightly shorter. And that centipede also has the texture of a silver knife and is extremely sharp. If it runs over the body and goes back and forth several times, it will definitely be the same as a thousand cuts. Turn it into minced meat on the spot. It seems that this should be the final boss of the elite trial site. Chen Mu has full confidence in this. In terms of deterrence, hundreds of thousands of small centipedes are not as good as it. Roar. After that, he quickly moved his centipedes and rushed towards Chen Mu. Four silver long knives were raised high, ready to tear him into pieces at any time. Boom, boom, Chen Mu's hands were like tiger's claws, half clasped, he summoned two fireballs, threw them towards the giant centipede, and threw them over. The giant centipede slashed down the double sabers directly, breaking the wind and raising dust. Instead of relying on the edge of the blade, only relying on the air wave generated by swinging the blade, the two fireballs were cut away from it. Dissipate. It can be seen from this that the strength of its arms is terrifying. On the ground, you can clearly see the cut marks, one finger deep and more than 10 meters deep. Although his body was huge, he didn't slow down his movement speed at all. After a while, he arrived in front of Chen Mu, brandishing four silver knives at the same time. However, it came to nothing. Teleportation works beyond imagination. At this time, Chen Mu appeared behind the giant centipede, with a blind spot in his vision. First wrap the giant centipede's muscle lines with air lines and move towards the clear limbs to limit its mobility. Then, the fireball above the head condensed over a hundred with the long knife in the air. Boom, 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 call out, call out, call out. The fireball and the long knife fell at the same time, hitting the giant centipede hard. No matter how tough the shell was, it couldn't stop the successive violent attacks, and it gradually burst. The giant centipede let out a shrill scream, struggling to break free. You still want to run. Chen Mu made it thicker, added more air lines, and at the same time endowed it with infinite acceleration gain. Under the high-frequency vibration, the already sharp line cuts through the hard red shell and emits smoke. After breaking through the shell, the flesh and blood inside was cut off in the blink of an eye. The four sword hands all hit the ground, making metal impact sounds. Gaining a short moment of freedom, the giant centipede cooperated with centipedes, turned around quickly, opened its mandibles, and opened its mouth wide. What? Spitting out sewer-colored liquid, trying to bathe Chen Mu. As everyone knows, under the crisis awareness ability, all the attack methods of the giant centipede are all in Chen Mu's mind in advance, like a movie showing. 
Even if there is no teleportation ability, it can still be easily dodged. Wow, the liquid sprayed out by the giant centipede is not only smelly, but its corrosive power is not comparable to that of the small centipedes. In just a few seconds, the ground was dissolved into a one-meter deep pit, enough to put a coffin in. With such a dangerous target, Chen Mu didn't want to give it a chance to get close to him. In an instant, dense invisible threads wrapped around the giant centipede's body. In the next moment, tighten up. It even forcibly closed its mouth. However, even if the saliva flows back, it will not cause any corrosive damage to itself. On the other hand, fortunately, unlike giant zombies, this giant centipede has amazing healing abilities. After the forelimb was severed, it never recovered. The timing is about right. Chen Mu grasped the hundred long threads with five fingers, and swung them suddenly. A pull. The giant centipede stopped struggling in an instant, and then, its body fell apart, like a building toppled, and was cut into hundreds of disc shapes. The cross section of flesh and blood could be clearly seen, including the less obvious white giant bones hidden in the green blood. In this way, even if the giant centipede has the self-healing ability like a giant zombie, it is still powerless. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for clearing the elite trial land. Task rewards have been issued. Congratulations to the host for getting the backpack expansion grid plus 10, the overlord centipede larva plus 1, the poisonous dagger plus 1, and the supplement fluid plus 5. As the backpack expanded, opening it, the storage space of the system backpack has indeed increased a lot. Overlord centipede larva, if Chen Mu understands correctly, are equivalent to pets. They can be at their own disposal, and if they are well cultivated, they can grow into giant centipedes and even evolve into other more terrifying forms. The appearance of the highly poisonous dagger is much more ordinary. Click to view the details. The dagger comes with centipede poison. Even if it is scratched a little, a big hole will be corroded immediately. Supplementary liquid has a wide range of effects, it can supplement exhausted stamina, enhance satiety, reduce hunger and other negative effects on the body. Contented and happy, Chen Yu has nothing to complain about. After three minutes, you will be forced to leave the trial ground, of course, you can also choose to leave by yourself. The next second after the system prompted, Chen Yu saw out of the corner of his eye, a whirlpool door opened beside him. Chen Yu circled around and glanced around, seeing a dilapidated land with nothing to explore. Not to mention only three minutes. Turn around and walk straight into the whirlpool gate. Go away. Go away, don't come over. This talent walked halfway through the whirlpool door, and as soon as his ears popped out, he immediately heard the roar of someone in front of him. And the endless sound of gunfire. With a glance, Chen Yu found that the entrance and exit were not in the same place, this place was very strange to him, and he had no memory of it at all. As the exit location random, Chen Yu raised his hand to his forehead, a little speechless, wondering where the system sent him to. He was quite satisfied with the hotel room last night. Isn't it time to find a place to stay again? I just hope it's not too far away. You, don't be dazed. If you don't want to be drowned, join hands and solve that monster together. There was a shout in the ear. Although I don't know where and when Chen Mu appeared. But at the moment, there are heavy casualties, and men don't care about so many. It is a strength to have more strength. If you don't work together at this time, everyone will die. Chen Mu didn't look at him, and immediately locked his eyes on the one that was moving by the fountain in the square, a huge water column. Take a step sideways, and after changing the angle, you can see clearly that it is a stream of blue water with a fuzzy human silhouette. There are no legs, just a pool of water that swirls and flows upwards. It looks very clear, without debris, but you can't see the structure inside. It is very thick. The waist is broad, the arms are thick, there are not too many details, but the lines and outlines are vaguely visible. The fingers are more like animal claws. The reason why the head can be seen as a head is thanks to the fact that it is wearing a metal knight helmet that is completely out of proportion to the body. Moving again, with the help of the sunlight, Chen Mu vaguely saw a black figure struggling inside the body of the water giant. Both feet kicked desperately, a pair of arms raised high, trying to grab something, bubbling and bubbling. Fingers and toes finally emerged from the water giant's belly, and the next second, they were sucked in again by the vortex. Under the body of the three-meter-high giant, 
people looked very small in front of it, without any deterrent force. Seeing the water giant moving towards him, dragging the puddle of blue water that came up from nowhere. Bang bang bang. Even though he knew that the bullet had no effect, the man kept pulling the trigger, and the muzzle flashed. Chen Mu could see clearly that after the bullet entered the body of the water giant, its speed was slowed down immediately. One can imagine the suction power. A thread floated out, spun along the water flow, and gently wrapped around the body of the Shengshui giant. Then tense instantly, the knot is pulled to death. Cut open the chest of that water giant. However, such an attack method was not effective for it, as soon as it was cut, it stuck together again the next second. How can a knife cut boiling water? Fortunately, the target of Chen Emu's attack at the beginning was not the water giant, so it can't be said that he was disappointed or disappointed. Xiao Zhao, the man saw very clearly that the water giant's body separated instantly, and also separated, and his companion who was only breathing. Blood gushed out, and then flowed through the water, dyeing the water giant's body red, the color gradually faded. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill petrification armor, which will automatically upgrade to SSS level earth armor. The skill of petrified armor can cover the surface of the body with a layer of rocks. It is a skill that enhances defense. For attack, it improves slightly because the fists and feet become harder. And after upgrading to the SSS level earth armor, the body becomes larger, the hardness and thickness are even more amazing, not only that, but also can mobilize such as soil and stones for your own use. It is impossible for the man to know that the death of his companion was caused by Chen Mu. Push all the sins to the water giant. But more fear than anger. Companion. He is indeed a companion, but it has only been less than two hours since the formation of the team, so it is a bit difficult for him to cry. It's far worse than seeing someone die in front of you with your own eyes, and the visual and spiritual shock brought about by the death in the hands of monsters is even stronger. Click, Kaka. But at this time, the only firearms and weapons that can give men a sense of security are out of bullets. Seeing the water giant getting closer, the death side was already on its neck. The man started to use his brain, turned his gaze to Chen Mu, and used his skills. Immediately, Chen Mu felt his eyes go dark. About half a second or so. Then, there was a push from behind. However, the man's strength is not enough to push Chen Mu. As steady as Mount Tai, stay still. Turn around. Looking at each other, the man looked a little embarrassed. Well, listen to my explanation. Chen Mu bent down to pick up the fully loaded gun that the man threw away on the ground. Under the SSS level infinite ammunition skill, the magazines that were originally empty can be filled up at once. I gave you that thing, goodbye. The man turned and wanted to run. I believe that as long as I run fast enough, I will not become the target of the water giant. Sacrifice Chen Mu in exchange for his own life. Although I feel sorry for him, I'm sorry, in this kind of world, kindness is destined to not live long. Men want to survive, so they must be ruthless. Boom. However, before this foot took two steps, the sound of gunfire suddenly rang out. There was a sharp pain in the chest, and the white clothes were quickly stained red by the oozing blood. How come? The man's face was full of puzzled words, obviously he had already fired all the bullets just now. No matter how fast Chen Emu's hands are, it's impossible to replace the magazine in a second or two, right? What's more, I didn't hear a sound at all. Chen Mu will not be merciful to those who want to take him as a scapegoat. The arm is raised, the muzzle is raised a little, and it is aimed at the back of the man's head. Boom. Pull the trigger. Boom. The body fell to the ground with a muffled sound. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level skill blindfold, and automatically upgrade to SSS level ghost blindfold. Blind eyes. Seeing these two words, Chen Mu finally understood why On's eyes suddenly went dark just now. I thought there was something wrong with my body. It turned out to be that guy's skill, which can be cast on a single object, causing it to lose vision for 1.5 seconds. After upgrading to SSS level ghost cover, the target is no longer restricted, and the loss of vision time is extended to one minute. In this minute, what is lost is the vision of the white world, but the door to the black world is opened. All kinds of demons and goblins are mobilized and entangled, but for those with weak psychological endurance, the possibility of being frightened to death is definitely not zero. 
How about telling ghosts to cover their eyes? It's just that this skill has little effect on monsters, especially monsters that have no intelligence and only know how to kill. Even if it really makes the other party lose their vision, it will speed up the monster's mad state and make it more difficult to deal with. In short, this is a skill designed for players. Take back your thoughts, put the gun in the system backpack, and keep it to trade food resources. Hush, the sound of water coming from behind became more and more noisy. The crisis sensor was triggered, and Chen Mu teleported three meters away. When he turned around, he saw that the water giant's water claw fell into the air. Although the claws are made of water, their power is not weak at all. A few drops of water formed a line and splashed on the marble tiles, splitting them on the spot. It is said that water and fire are incompatible, water can overcome fire, but Chen Mu does not believe in this evil, thinking that as long as the firepower is strong enough, the water giant in front of him can definitely be evaporated. It happened to test the SSS level dragon flame breath obtained before the test. Snapped. With a snap of the fingers, beside Chen Mu, a golden light suddenly appeared, and a faucet that was not watertight at all in terms of size emerged out of thin air. Seemingly translucent, the line of sight cannot pass through. Molten it. Chen Mu ordered. Boom. The dragon's mouth opened, and a tornado-like flame spewed out, the momentum was astonishing. This power, this temperature, can definitely easily turn a person into charcoal powder. After all, it is Chen Emu's own skill, even if it is so close, it will not burn him. The flames were a little bit dazzling. The water giant also reacted immediately, raising its arms, the outline of the arms disappeared, melted, and condensed again, looking like a shield. With a water shield, resist the flames. When the two sides collided, there was a wild sizzle, and a large amount of white gas rose up, like a mushroom cloud. On the side of the faucet, the fire has not been reduced by half, but the size of the water giant is shrinking in a visible trend. It can be seen from this that the water of the water giant is not unlimited. From 3 meters, evaporated to 2 meters. 1 meter, half a meter. The body shape is getting smaller and smaller. Bang bang. The helmet fell to the ground. Long Yin's breathing stopped. But the strange thing is that Chen Mu didn't see the kill prompt. After looking carefully, it was found that there were still a few drops of water hidden under the knight's helmet. After gathering together, they quickly flowed along the cracks in the masonry. Instead of continuing to attack Chen Mu, he fled to the fountain pool. The sound of falling water. At this distance, if you want to use your breath to stop it, it will definitely be too late. The fact is just as Chen Mu expected, those few drops of water, reabsorbing the fountain water, the body continues to skyrocket and return to its original state, enriching the details, contours and muscle lines. The water giant successfully completed, rebirth. Unfortunately not human, Chen Mu is quite interested in this ability. However, right now he can only pick up the skills dropped by humans after death, not monster skills. Pity, the water giant moves out of the fountain pool. After all, its body is made of water, and it can change its shape arbitrarily without being hindered. Stretch out your arm, extend it infinitely, wrap it, and suck the knight's helmet that is still hot on the ground, steaming and cooling down quickly. Thump, lift it up high and cover it heavily on the head, and it will be considered to fully restore its original appearance. Although the fight just now almost made the water giant evaporate on the spot, it didn't intend to stop. It moved towards Chen Mu, intending to continue to attack him. The dragon's head was still floating beside Chen Mu, there was no need to open his mouth, as soon as he thought about it, the dragon's mouth opened. Boom, spit out dragon flames again, bake the water giant, this scene is perfectly repeated. The water giant's water is not enough to resist the breath of dragon flames. This time, it learned some lessons. After the water in its body was severely evaporated, it reacted quickly and planned to escape back into the fountain pool. Chen Mu naturally couldn't give it a chance. First teleport to the fountain pool, lift your toes, and touch the ground. The ice spread rapidly, and in the blink of an eye, the three floors in the fountain pool and the three floors outside were all frozen, without any gaps. SSS level frost realm, not to mention a small fountain pool, as long as Chen Mu is willing, the visible range can be completely frozen in a single thought. The miniature water giant smashed its head on the ice, but found that it couldn't get in, couldn't absorb water, and recovered its body. Therefore, 
He was furious and wanted to attack Chen Mu. A claw swung out, but it missed. Teleportation plus danger perception ability, without the speed of light, it is impossible to even touch half of his hair. At this time, the water giant was pleasantly surprised to find that he could absorb water. The ice is melting, he didn't notice at all what caused the ice to melt, where he greedily absorbed water, trying to restore his huge body. Seeing that the flames were entwined and the fireballs were almost condensed, Chen Yu felt that it was time to end this battle. Although I didn't receive the daily tasks related to the water giant, it's good to be rewarded with killing points. Boom, boom, the giant fireball slammed down. The fountain looks small in front of it. The ice melts and is quickly evaporated by the high temperature, and the white gas looks like thick fog. Boom, the raging fire rose high like a tide, but not a single drop of water was seen. The mist dissipated in a short time, leaving behind a piece of scorched earth, which was displayed in front of Chen Mu. Also displayed, there are system prompts. Successfully killed the water giant. Congratulations to the host for getting 10 kill points. 10 killing points, is this guy twice as powerful as a giant zombie? Chen Mu didn't know if the conversion was correct. I feel that apart from the fact that water can restore this, there is no other bright spot. Or are those SSS level skills of his own too perverted? At the same time, in the regional chat channel, the elite boss of this round has been killed by player Chen Mu alone. As soon as this news came out, the regional chat channel exploded. I rely on it. So strong, solo killing the elite boss. Isn't this one called Chen Mu too strong? What's the background? Thanks to him, we were saved from the fate of being massacred. Yeah, the setting of this monster is too outrageous. If you don't solve it, you will keep looking for players to kill. This is forcing people not to be salty, and they must desperately improve their strength. I always thought that I had bad luck in awakening F-level skills, but I didn't expect that my luck was used to respawn in the same area as the boss. This one is called Chen Mu, if I remember correctly, there is a high probability that it will be number one in the heaven list, ground list, and double list, right? What, that ruthless guy who killed four figure monsters on the first day? Dot dot dot, Chen Mu didn't know about the hot discussion he caused in the chat channel. At this time, he was looking surprised at the system prompt that popped up in front of him. Congratulations to the host for successfully killing the water giant, completing the regional elite boss crusade mission, and the reward is being settled. Settlement successful. Congratulations to the host for getting the water giant summoning card X1. Summon card. Chen Mu is quite interested in this reward. Open the system backpack and select view details. Water giant summoning card. You can summon a water giant for your own use and the duration is 10 minutes. Only 10 minutes. Isn't that too picky? Chen Mu said speechlessly. However, if you think about it carefully, as long as you find the right opportunity, for example, when a large number of monsters appear in the tide of corpses, summoning this guy, even if it is only 10 minutes, is enough to gain a lot of killing points and take the opportunity to improve your strength. For general players, it is a powerful prop. For players with strong strength, it is the icing on the cake. As for Chen Mu, it can be used to play, it is purely fresh. Trade, there is no need to give others such powerful props. In his eyes, those more than 10 billion people are all competitors. It can't be said that he was disappointed, after all, Chen Mu didn't know from the beginning that there was such an event when he went to the place of trial. It was a windfall, for the next time, Chen Mu planned to take a rest. He had just gone through two battles, so he had to take a break and replenish his energy by the way. Randomly teleport to the top of a tall building, sit in a corner, with your legs hanging in the air more than 10 floors high. Calmly, he took out the bread, tore it open, scooped up a spoonful of beef, and sandwiched it with another piece of bread. The bread, which was originally a bit hard, softened a lot after soaking up the soup, and it was very satisfying to bite down, without choking at all. It feels like an open-air picnic, but the scenery in front of me is not very pretty. Fortunately, it did not affect Chen Emu's appetite. Ah, I'm sorry. I apologize. I apologize. I deserve to be robbed by you. It's my own incompetence. I shouldn't be your enemy. Please, let me go. Chen Mu was eating, when a man yelled suddenly, the sound of a car's engine, and cheers from several people came from afar. Belch, putting down the water bottle, 
hiccuping, and looking down, he saw a group of people coming by car. A person was chained to the back of the car and dragged along the ground. Behind the car, there were more than a dozen corpse dogs chasing wildly. They all want to bite off a piece of meat from the man, their bony appearance looks like they haven't eaten for several days, their eyes are blood red, and their saliva splashes. The man tried his best to straighten his waist to reduce the rubbing area of his back on the ground, but there were still traces of blood everywhere he passed. This greatly stimulated the group of corpse dogs. Are people nowadays so good at playing? Chen Mu said speechlessly. Daddy plays with your woman, that's how I value you, otherwise why don't I play with other women's women? Are you right? In the convertible, the young man acted boldly, standing on the back seat, raising his legs high, stepped on the rear of the car, arrogant and domineering. Yes, yes, you were right, the man had to endure the humiliation if he wanted to live. Daddy thinks highly of you if he cuckolds you, doesn't he? The young man asked again, laughing more and more wildly. Yes, yes, please let me live, I don't want to die. The man's voice was mixed with tears. He just wants to protect his own wife, that's all. This group of people wanted to force the man's wife because of their lust, but the man fought back, but his strength was no match. Being trampled on the ground, watching them tear up their wives' clothes. In the end, the wife couldn't bear the humiliation and committed suicide by biting her tongue. The young man was not interested in corpses, so he became angry from embarrassment, and decided to vent his anger on the man, so this scene happened. Let me go, are you kidding me, your wife is ignorant, causing daddy to have nowhere to vent her anger. Now I have to use your death to vent my anger. The young man sneered. The laughing man is too naive. Then, he signaled his companions in the driver's seat to slow down, so that the group of corpse dogs could take advantage of it. Bite your legs, and then accelerate instantly. Stab it. The man's legs, together with his pants, were torn off by two huge forces. Because of excessive blood loss, falling into a coma, and then death, things happened very quickly. At this time, the young man chose to let go of the chain. After breaking free, the man's corpse was quickly wrapped around the iron chain, and sparks burst out on the ground, but it still couldn't stop the corpse dogs from launching a fierce attack. This is exactly what the middle-aged and young people want to do. They use the man's corpse to attract the attention of the corpse dogs, and then take the opportunity to join hands with their companions to eliminate the corpse dogs, get rewards for killing points, and contribute to the unlimited fun of life. This sports car was purchased from the system store with killing points. Just, don't wait for them to do it. Boom, boom, boom. Gunshots rang out suddenly, successfully killed the corpse dog. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point successfully killed the corpse dog. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Successfully killed the corpse dog. Congratulations to the host for getting one kill point. Dot dot dot. The shooter was none other than Chen Mu. Proficient in SSS level firearms, combined with SSS level unlimited ammunition, he can kill more than a dozen corpse dogs in the blink of an eye. When the young man heard the gunshots, he thought someone was attacking him, so he jumped out of the car and hid behind the car. Immediately, he looked up and locked onto Chen Mu who was sitting on the roof of the building, holding a gun to harvest the corpses of dogs. He gritted his teeth and clenched his fingers tightly, that guy dared to snatch our prey. Are you dying? Boss, let's go upstairs and kill him while he's not paying attention. Someone suggested. N. The young man nodded and agreed without thinking. Fear. Joke. The three of them, 2F level skills, plus 1E level skill, why are there any reasons to be afraid of Chen Mu alone? The young man's E level skill is called Shield Wall, which can summon a huge shield out of thin air, not to mention bullets, even if a grenade explodes in front of him, it can still block all the power without injury. This is the confidence of youth. He lifted the corner of his lips, and a cold smile appeared on his face. He would definitely let Chen Mu understand how tragic it would be if he dared to cut off Huon. By the way, harvest his killing points. This is called praying mantis catching cicada, the oriole is behind. A few people came to the top floor in one breath, and the door lock was already rusted. However, this kind of door can be kicked open with one kick, and the three of them are not worried at all. A young man named Zhu Yanghong, who is also the leader of this team, conspired in a low voice, 
I will rush in and activate my skills immediately to block his bullets. After the distance gets closer, the two of you will be responsible for attacking from the side. Find a chance and kill him, understand? Understood. The two nodded their heads heavily and said in unison. Boom. As soon as the words were finished, Zhu Yanghong raised his leg, kicked hard, responded, and easily knocked down the door, leaving a half-foot-deep mark. The hinges were severely rusted and broke directly from the middle, and the inside was already layered one by one. Seeing that Chen Mu was still sitting on the ground, he didn't respond, and the gun was beside him, so he didn't intend to pick it up. The three of them, Zhu Yanghong, felt that they were underestimated. Hey, are you deaf? Can't you hear? Zhu Yanghong roared. The other two companions had already loaded their pistols, and locked onto Chen Mu with their hands clenched. Think you have the upper hand. They looked at each other and smiled. I didn't choose the head, but the chest, which has a larger area and is easier to hit. They are not like Chen Mu, who have a 100% hit rate. Just wait for Zhu Yanghong's order, and be mentally prepared to pour all the bullets on Chen Mu. There is always a shot that can kill. Don't worry. Chen Mu scooped up the last piece of beef and put it into his mouth. I wanted to raise my head to drink the remaining soup, but after thinking about it, I decided to use bread to absorb it, and scrape off the minced meat and grease on the inner wall of the can. Put it in your mouth, it is very satisfying, and it is 80% full. Boss, this kid doesn't want to put us in one's eyes at all, just kill him directly. He couldn't bear it. Yes, Zhu Yanghong nodded in agreement, not wanting to waste time, let alone waste skills. Different from Chen Emu's SSS skills, the skills of the few of them consume a lot of stamina every time they are released, and there is a cooldown time. The SSS skill itself is also consumed, but this setting is erased by the system when it is automatically upgraded. That is to say, all of Chen Emu's skills consume zero and have no cooldown, and can be released without limit. Chen Mu would like to call it the most perverted in history. Aim with one eye, and after confirming that it is correct, pull the trigger. Boom. The bullet spins out at high speed. But he didn't see the blood oozing from Chen Emu's body. Missed. Shouldn't it? Kun Tu thought to himself that Ohm's marksmanship shouldn't be that bad. Hey. Dot you, look at the ground. Another Wangfa said with a frightened expression. Zhu Yanghong, Kudu immediately followed what Huang Fa said, and lowered his head to look. Pupils dilated. I just feel incredible. On the ground, apart from the fallen bullet casings, there was actually a bullet that was evenly cut in half from the middle. How so? An inexplicable fear arises spontaneously. I still don't believe it. It must be a coincidence. The inch-cut man comforted himself with this, and pulled the trigger again. But no matter how many times he pulled it, the result was the same. Chen Mu was unharmed. Quote dot 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 quote. The yellow-haired, cropped man couldn't see the bullets clearly, but he could see them. There were a few more bullets on the ground that were also cut in the middle and turned into two halves. Why, how could this be? Click, kaka, the bullets have been shot by the inch. When he was about to change the bullet and continue attacking Chen Mu, blood suddenly exploded in front of his eyes. Both hands fell to the ground in front of own face. Staring, mouth wide open, expression contorted, ah, my hand, my hand, why, why? I don't understand at all. What is going on at this moment? Why do bullets get cut? Why is Own's hand cut open? I'm dreaming, I'm sure I'm dreaming, right? This smile is uglier than crying, trying to comfort Own at the same time, the pain of the severed hand intensified wildly, rushing to the brain. What the hell kind of perverted skill is this? Zhu Yanghong also panicked. Immediately raised his arms and cast his skills, a translucent golden light giant shield appeared, completely covering the three of them. It should be all right now. Zhu Yanghong breathed a sigh of relief. Chen Emu's skills are too weird, never heard of, never seen before. He has been paying attention to Chen Emu's behavior, and he is very sure that he has no relevant actions. So how did this work? Weird, it's so weird. Hurry up and bandage his wound, I'll bear it first. Zhu Yanghong ordered another person. At the same time, it was clearly seen that Chen Mu raised his hand, which was likened to the shape of a gun. Zhu Yanghong frowned slightly. Is this man out of his mind? In the next second, he saw his thumb pressing down slightly. Crack. Quote dot 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 quote. 
Zhu Yang Hong's eyes widened, his mouth opened wide, and he was stunned on the spot. He could see clearly that his own shield was broken into countless pieces in an instant. This shield, which can block even the explosion of a grenade, can't block Chen Emu's playful attack. Are you sure you're not joking? He even began to wonder if he was dreaming now. Huang Fa hasn't had time to agree yet. Seeing the giant shield shattered, his mentality immediately collapsed. On the contrary, he became more and more daring, his hands were crackling, and the thunder pattern was flickering non-stop, and then, a golden lightning spear was quickly condensed. Grab your five fingers and hold them up high. Shouted. I will fight with you. Go to hell. Zizi Lala. Throwing the lightning spear, the electric lines linger. It looks pretty bluffing. This, Huang Fa was stunned, unable to figure out why his own lightning spear went straight through Chen Mu without causing any damage. In fact, it wasn't the lightning spear that passed through Chen Mu, but Chen Mu cast the ghost shadow movement technique to avoid the spear. But because the speed is too fast, the naked eye can't see it clearly, it looks like it's going straight through. Chen Mu happened to use these three people to display the new skills he had just acquired. Ghost blindfolded, raise your hand, wipe it, and draw a semicircle in the air. In an instant, the eyes of the three of them turned black. Demons, demons, ghosts, monsters, come out together. For example, the snake with the short head is the most feared, the whole body is entangled by the giant snake, the neck is tightened, and the feeling of suffocation is strong. At the same time, the snake's head protruded from the back of its neck, facing Kun Tu, uttering a snake letter. No, don't, the eyeballs rolled up, revealing a large white area. The giant snake ignored it, and suddenly opened its blood basin, and bit it with one bite. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining the F-level observation enhancement, and automatically upgrading to the SSS level seeing eye. That's right, Bunny was scared to death. And this SSS level see through eye skill, if Chen Mu understands it correctly, after release, it can see through players, zombies, and monsters, so as to know their fatal weaknesses. This allows for faster and more efficient harvesting. Successful kill. Congratulations to the host for obtaining an F-level lightning spear, which will automatically upgrade to an SSS level lightning Dharma King. The name says it all, it can control the power of lightning. Wang Mayo's way of death. Lying on the bed, I heard the slight breathing sound from under the bed repeatedly, lying on the bed uncontrollably, leaning over to look. Eyes poked out. It turned out that it was a stiff woman's face with disheveled hair, face as pale as paper, and a tongue one or two meters long. The tongue seemed to be equipped with a spring launcher, it suddenly stretched out, wrapped around Wang Mayo's neck, and dragged him into the darkness forcibly. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.